Okay, hang on a second. Right, good evening everybody. Good evening and welcome. Uh, welcome indeed. What is it? It is Tuesday, so I was about to say, I was about to say it's Tuesday without being sure. I thought it was going mad. Um, yes, so hi. Uh, hi everyone. Uh, hang on, I'm just going to move the microphone a bit further back, further back. It's a bit loud. I'll turn myself down a little bit. Hang on. Hang on, turn that down a notch. Uh, I know why I'm speaking loudly. I'll, I'll explain in a minute. Um, yeah, just going to turn that down. Um, yes, I've, I've got like a different pair of headphones on. Uh, uh, so I was talking loudly because I can't hear my own voice again. Because they're like a noise cancellation. Um, right, so yes, good morning. Oh, fuck. <laughs> good, ev good evening, everyone. Um, I'm just sitting here in the TeamSpeak room, uh, TeamSpeak room waiting for Quebec... Digby and Messiesi, who should be on shortly. And uh, we're going to crack on with a bit of Divinity 2, uh, the definitive edition, which is the expansion pack to Divinity. We did actually complete Divinity, for those uh, who, are who are perhaps confused. Uh, but apparently the expansion pack changes quite a lot of things, uh, particularly from Act 3 onwards. And we're quite interested in seeing what those things were. Um, so, uh, you know, we're, we're just going to play and, um, and give it a go. Um, so before they get here, uh, just to bring you up to speed as to what's going on, um, oh, what's that nice humble brag? Which, which, which part was the humble brag, uh, Joff? What did I say? Um, thank you, the McBanjo. Thank you. <clears throat> uh, just to bring you up to speed on what's going on this week, it is the start of the sixth week of work on the latest YouTube video, which takes the form of a an entry into a video essay series that I've been working on. It's part 10 of 10, of, uh, of a video essay, uh, well, just a, a playlist, uh, talking about DayZ. Thank you, Gluco and Sharpie. Thank you, thank you both of you. Thank you kindly. Thank you. Um, and, uh, yeah, I, I am, I'm quite tired and a bit scatterbrained, I'm afraid, because, uh, I've been working very hard today in order to get it over the line, and it's nearly, it's, it's nearly done. It's, it's almost there. Um, I want to go back and, and watch it again and maybe fix a few bits that I wasn't sure about. Um, oh, about, about the fancy new sound cancelling headphones. Well, I think these are... Well, it's a new pair, but that's only, only because my old pair broke. Um, it's not like I've bought shiny stuff. It's just, you know, this is the... Um, this is... Uh, besides, it's just a plastic pile of shit. They're not even that expensive. Um, thank you, Murder3R Doll, Murder Doll, and Epitrope and DJ Gamer. Thank you both. Thank you, all of you. That's very kind. Thank you, guys. Hang on a second. So I will turn myself down just a notch more because I'm pushing into the red a few times when I uh, when I when I put my voice up. Um, hang on, I'm also just going to put that on so I can see if I can join Quebec's server. Uh, no, he's launched the game, but he hasn't started one yet. Um, sorry, what was I saying? So yes, uh, the latest YouTube video is almost done, is what I'm saying. That, that's the point. Um, I just need to just need to get it over the line. Um, but forgive me if I perhaps seem a bit a little bit crabby. Uh, it is stressing me out. I am very tired. It's been a long day. Um, but, um, oh, so no more work, no more work today. That's it. I, I'll, I'll pick it up at like six in the morning tomorrow. <laughs> just, I'll wake up early just to crunch some more. Um, cause, uh, yeah, I just need to get it done. Thank you, alcoholic. Thank you very much, alcoholic. Thank you. Um, and, uh, Tan Luz and, uh, Pap, Pap D Pink and Bright Sides. Thank you guys, sincerely. And Snowy. Thank you, Snowy. Thank you guys. Thank you for the subs. Right, okay, so Quebec, uh, Messi's here as well, so uh, Messi's fiance Digby should get here soon. And, um, yeah, and then we'll get going. <clears throat> so, what else is going on? Um, this week is quite eventful, actually. Um, I'm picking up my first ever car. Um, I put down the payment on it um, uh, earlier this week, and uh, I, I get to go pick it up, if, if I choose, on Friday evening. Um, I might not, though. I'm not sure yet. Um, one of my fears, and I don't know, some people might listen to this and they might think this is a bit daft. Um, I don't think I should be the one to perhaps drive it back from the drive it from the car dealership. Um, I think I should get somebody else to, uh, simply because uh, I haven't driven an automatic out on the road before, and the junction where the car dealership is is one of the busiest in the city. Uh, so I don't want to fuck it up and you know dent the car in like the first fucking you know the first junction because I don't you know I'm, I'm not familiar with the uh, the pedals effectively I'm, I'm not used to them so I might try and get someone else to, to, to drive it back to my uh, to my place uh, and then I'm just gonna wake up at like four in the morning when no one else is around and then and then you know practice get get used to it because um, you know it's a, it's a completely different make of car 
I've never driven an automatic, and um, you know I don't want to fuck it up and dent a car, <laughs> dent a quite a, quite a nice car. Um, thank you, Zan. Thank you very much, Zan. Thank you. <clears throat> mm. Right. Um, hang on. Right. So the rest of them appear to be ready. So let me just see if I can drop in. So yes. Um, apologies. Uh, there can't be a great deal of audience interaction this evening, just due to the nature of divinity. But um, I hope you enjoy the show. I hope you. Uh, yeah. Welcome everyone. Thank you, Zan. Thank you. Hello. Ah. Hello. Oh, blimey. <coughs> you are. Loud yes. Quebec. Loud Quebec indeed. <laughs> oh, no. Jesus <laughs> Christ. So <Sorry>, you're right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Might turn you down. Hang on. Yeah, no worries. That wouldn't be the first time. Right. <clears throat> right, that is fantastic. How are we doing? Oh, God, good? plus nine. I don't know. Maybe I'm just talking too loud. No, no, I had to turn it back. I had to turn up really high. Thank you, Crammed. Thank you very Wait. much, Crammed. Thank you. Yes, I did lose my fucking Atar of the Blood Rose, didn't I? Uh, you what? Um, I had a. There's a special potion you can get only in the first act called the Atar of the Blood Rose. Oh, that killing. one, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've lost it because I died in the uh, fight against uh, Dallas's monster men. Yes, you did. I did. Mm. I died like a blazing scrub. Mm. Oh, it's good to be back aboard the Vengeance. Yes. Can't wait till we get to uh, to what's it called, Driftwood. Driftwood, yes. Like there's, I, like literally all of the good spells are there. Yeah, all of them. I want my Phoenix dive because you you might notice that I'm sort of plodding around, not able to get into the battle. Yeah, you know I've got no. I mean I could spec one point into Huntress, but uh, Huntress, you know Hunter thing. Huntsman. Mate, Hunt Huntsman. Huntsman. Huntress. Huntress. I'm just gonna go to the mirror. What's the hi there, guys? Hello. Hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome one, Ooh. welcome all. Ooh, Ooh there's just it's just bottles of wine all over the place. I'll have those. <laughs> Don't mind me. I just, just, I'm, I'll, gonna pull on these for the good of the cause. Uh huh. Uh huh. I don't know what I'll do. I'll just do that. Hang on. Just gonna turn up Teamspeak volume. Okay. Um. Yes. Hopefully the the chat is of a fucking similar. Uh, yeah. Words. I, I. You know. What? I don't have enough. I don't have enough brain cells to allocate to yeah. the remainder of that sentence. It, it's so been, we're it's, gonna leave it there. It's been a very long day here as well. <laughs> very long day indeed. How comes your latest project, sir? It's almost I've 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 crammed since about nine in the morning. Uh, I've just worked flat out. It is so close to completion, so close, and so that, close to completion, and yet so far from. Completion. I know. Is that your doomsday device? Oh, it's oh, it's, it's a mistake. I'll tell you what it's, it is. The whole thing was a. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I, I again, I lack the words to properly explain. It's a, it's a very long project that I think I shouldn't have started, but well, you know, now that I'm almost done, I might as well just finish it. That's the one. Put it out. Air your dirty <sighs> yeah. laundry. I know. That's the one. <clears throat> and then we can all laugh at you. Yeah. Thank Looking you, Mr. Kelsor. Thank you very much. More than usual? Huh? <laughs> More than usual. More than usual. Ah, fuck you. <laughs> uh, hang on a minute. I'm going to put a point into I think you'll find, sir, that's my job. So if you would uh, refrain from doing so, that would be most handy. Right. Thank you, Cream Mayor. Thank you, Cream Mayor. And I mean, Mr. Kelsor, thank you. To even attempt doing that, he'd need to leave his place for once in a while. Yeah, he'd have to not be a hermit. That's very true. I'm not always... I can leave my... Sh shut up! I leave my flat all the time. I like going to... To walk your dog? Yeah, and... and what else? Well, sometimes I walk the dog. Sometimes I have a dog walk or walk my dog. So yeah, I, I don't have to leave you... every time. Um, all right, okay. So you're delegating the one <laughs> chance you get to actually not be a hermit to someone else. Yes. Uh, but sometimes, sometimes I go to the shops just around the corner, like when it's dark and no one will see me. That's the one when it's closed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then, then you rummage through the bins outside. Yeah. Glad I'm not alone there. Right. Oh yeah, did you get your car? I, I so it, it will be available at the car dealership on Thursday, and then I can pick it up from there. Although, so how excited are you? Although, although, hang on, I did have a question. Do either of you have a car? Uh, both yes. of us do. Um, so yeah. the, the car. I can I ask you this question? The, the car dealership told me something that confused me, and I, I don't know because it's my first time. They said that before they can hand over the keys, they need a certificate of insurance, right? But yeah, I think so. But the, uh, uh, so I was under the impression that um, well, the car comes with like uh, seven days insurance to start with, apparently. But I, I wait, sorry, where did you get that certificate from? Is it, you just printed off or something from you, your? You get. In, you get insured on the car, mm. 
and you bring proof you're insured on the car to get the because the idea is is that if you're driving it off the forecourt uh -huh. you are not insured on that vehicle the minute you buy it because it becomes sure. your vehicle sure but so I'm speak with you. to your insurer, get insured, mm -hmm. and then literally all they want is proof that you are insured sure. by your insurer. I, I, I'm with you. Sorry. What physically did you give them is what I'm saying. What What did you, you hand them? If you've got a confirmation email from a, um, say, if you, for example, my, my insurer is Churchill, surprisingly enough. If you have an email from them saying you're insured with us, that should be enough for them. Oh, so it's just it's a just, copy you, of your of your email. You've just got to prove to them that you are insured, and they'll probably ask you for proof of ID mm -hmm. that it's you anyway. So something that corroborates has, I would say, take something that you've got. From Thank your you, insurer, Berserk. Thank you very much, Berserk. Thank you. And your name, so that you can then go to your insurer because you can go to the dealer and say, "Here's my insurance, and to prove it's me, sure. here's my driving license." So, so sorry, my ne um, next question. So, um, do I have to wait then? For something to arrive from the insurance company in the post is that that's that's what I'm trying to get at. Uh, what, what physically do you hand them? I would uh, check with them to see what they will take because they should take a they should take an email from your insurer to say congratulations, you're insured, your stuff's in the post. But just double check it with the dealership because each dealership's different. Okay, cool, thank you. I, I just handed them a faded bus ticket and they were alright. <laughs> okay, right. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, brilliant. So yeah. <laughs> so, if you haven't already, I encourage you to do some trading with. Thank the you, man Dad Davis. With Thank last you. Time because Womble had some kind of god cod complex and ended up assassinating him in the seat that he sat in. I didn't assassinate him. Yeah, you right, stole. Actually, was, someone stole something. Collapsing. Someone stole uh, something off him, and then I just uh, didn't so, not hit him. When you say someone stole something, are you accusing the only person that can steal of stealing something? No, I think it was Digby, wasn't it? Someone grabbed a sword or no. something. No. 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 He, he attacked right. because you pissed him off. Thank you, Wash and Somra. Thank yes. you. Yeah, you, you, you accused him. You basically came in here. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. The, oh, it's flooding back to me, Your Honor. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we said we were going to... But in, in my defence, he's a fucking Magister assistant sitting in the headquarters yeah. with a weapon. What, do you, what the you... fuck do you think it looked like? You're going to fold in the witness box like a red-hot Mars bar. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I, I did what I had to do to protect you, the party. You watch. In a second, it's going to be like, they, they made me do it. It's, it's him. You guys, it's him, the you, man in the third row. You guys were the meta. Oh, he's a traitor. Oh, he's a traitor. You guys wouldn't last tw 10 fucking minutes in an actual uh, D&D game uh, uh, with a, with uh, a with a DM who you wants know, your blood. A DM I'll even. have you know, I read it in an ancient scroll. Thank you, Steph UK. Right. I've since sold. Right. And there is no proof. I've, uh -huh. I read it oh, in an thank ancient you, scroll. Thank you, Somra. Thank you very much, Somra. Thank you. of Reddit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Reddit the wise, who was both capricious and wise in equal measure. You're both idiots. <clears throat> uh, I'm just going to relieve this bloke of all of his gold. Yeah. <laughs> he has no gold. He has six gold. Where's all his gold gone? Guess. What, there's a fucking thief standing next to you. No, uh, I'm going to plead the fifth, Your Honor. Right. <laughs> Thank you, Luna. Thank <laughs> just, you very much, I was Luna. Gonna, I'm going to leave him all his gold by selling him all my useless shit. Where's his gold gone? We're going to have. That won't be the only time you have this problem in this playthrough. I promise yeah. you that. Anyway, so hang on. Just, just... I found a different trader for this call. So C cutting through the chat for a moment. Um, so to the audience. What we're doing currently is we're standing aboard a ship called the Lady Vengeance, which is a prison ship just off the coast of Fort Joy, which is where we've escaped. We are prisoners who are, who are escaping a penal camp for sorcerers, people who use a, a type of forbidden magic <laughs> called source. <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Um, we have commandeered the prison <laughs> ship and we're trying... What's wrong with you? I, I am actually ashamed to say which word I'm giggling at. Which one? Source? No. Uh, prison? What? What? Penal. Oh, for Christ's just, sake. Just, really? just carry on. Sh right, okay. Carry um, on. But yes, we are, we, are, we are basically trying to escape, but before we can, it seems that the ship systems will not move because it's actually a sentient ship. Uh, the wood is, is made out of a tree that's imbued with the spirit of an elf uh, because it, you know, that's what the elves do with their dead. They, they bury them beneath the trees and they, be well, they become trees. And uh, this one's been chopped down and, and you know, turned into a, a ship. So we need to find somewhere aboard the ship, some way to convince the spirit of the ship to move the, the fuck on so we can get out <laughs> we've got to exercise thank the you ship. dark o'dare yes. and wolf killed you thank you 
Well, convince it. Yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna find like a fucking porthole and like whisper into it. I'm gonna whisper into your porthole, Mister. <laughs> stick, stick your dick in it. Yes. Right. <clears throat> so do we have a lead? That, that would get me moving. I tell you. So fucking. <laughs> Are any right. of you necromancers? Uh, no. I yes. Are you? Good. Well, are I, you? I, I, quite a few. Sorry, wh why are you asking? Uh, I have two necromancer skill books. Oh, what are they? Can I know? Uh, infect and shackles of pain. Oh, I need the shackles of pain, definitely. Thank you. I've already got um, infect. I don't <gasps> want Thank to you, know Blubber. why Thank you need shackles, but yeah, enjoy. Have it. Thank you. Much appreciated. Thank you very much. Oh, perfect. Ooh. Yes, um, so my, my, I only take Necromancer after two, two skill points, but um, it gives me a whole load of abilities to assist my class. Thank you kindly. <laughs> Should get Gavin that for free. Oh, sick. Never mind. Right. Thank you, Blobber. No, Thank you kindly, you Blobber. get the boat moving. Yes, Which we do. I believe somebody might have acquired a, a, a weighty tome that may or may not have some ancient language in it. A weighty tome? Yes. I don't have a weighty tome. Who has panties in her inventory? Who's that? Emeralds, why do you have panties in your... Oh, I suppose you can have them. Hang on. Who's, who's got the weighty tome? The ones... Is it me? No. I've got, uh, I've got Butters Diary. Thank you, Peely, and I Green Road Gaming. Thank you, both tome. of you. Thank Who you. The, I, have, I, shall, I shall scour the inventories for the appropriate... Thank you, Lysander. Thank you, all of you. Thank you. Sold a weighty tome. Let me check the vendor. <laughs> no, 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 it's, uh, no, no, you've got it. You've got it. See it in your bag. It may or may not have a glowing aura around it. <laughs> yeah. Ah, Re the Graham. songbook. No, not meta. Yeah. I'll have you, you know. You I go read it sing, in an ancient sing scroll. The, sing to the boat. Huh? I'll, you, you sing to the boat. It's a songbook. What? It's fucking. It's written in ancient fucking lizard language. I can't read this shit. Uh, give it to me. Well, I have a scholar. This book is written in what appears to be an ancient dialect of the lizards. It content, its contents can be understood by few, but it might be possible to recite it phonetically. <laughs> okay, go, give go. it to me. Well I'll, done. I'll give it a go. Thank you. <laughs> you had a small stroke there, did you? Uh, that's the one. S Send me the book, sir. It sounds like a guitar riff. Oh, sorry, that's Emma Roy's. Jesus Christ. I thought it was an NPC. What? Sorry, I just said Emma Roy's was next to us the whole time, dressed like an NPC. Sorry, I thought it was. A, I was wondering, what's this NPC doing here? Sorry. Hi, Emma Roy's. Hello. Yes, hi. <laughs> Duck. Oh, dear. This is Send about as useful as thank those you. two NPCs. Thank you, Tahoma and oh, Telephone Mask. Right. Thank you, both of you. I think I've sent it, haven't I? Or did I send it back to Emma? I think you sent it to Emma. It's not, it's not in my bag. Uh, I haven't got it. Oh, it's like a pack of monkeys, for Christ's sake. Just give someone the tome. Read it. Oh. I, I gave it to someone. <clears throat> right. z r z r k r z r k Right. Urks, rook, rook, zerk, rook. There we go. Says yeah. the scholar. <laughs> That's better than whatever the fuck Quebec just fucking did. Thank you, did. XD well, you know, U W U. Like Thank you. I was doing it freestyle. Yeah. Thank you I was kindly. Freestyling it. I can give it a go. Well, do you want to try and yep. yes. like go and say this to the ship? Yep. Yes, that's the one. Go talk I'll, to the ship. I'll give it a, yeah, yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Right, so to the audience, we're heading to the front of the ship where we can convince the the spirit of the ship called the Lady Vengeance to get this damn thing moving. Here we go. Pray that they may find rest. Oh, okay. Here we go. We see a mark on the side of that figurehead. It's a living scar used to enslave the elves. At that moment, the ship serendipitously creaks beneath you, almost like it is acknowledging your observation. Thank you, the real Junji. I Thank sing you. the song from the tome. The deck beneath you groans and trembles, like the ship itself is awaking from a slumber. A deep sigh emerges, unmistakably the sound of a living being. Oh, Satan's it. I'm just thinking, with a living ship, what if it gets the hiccups? <laughs> you need a diaphragm to have pickups. Hey, Satan! Hello, Hello Satan. Satan! Hi, Satan! Come on up. Hello, no. Satan! Every where, stream, where Satan the cat. Are you coming up? Where the hell are you, you stupid beast? <laughs> don't, where have you come? Don't be mean to Satan! What's Satan done He's to mean you? To me. 
Huh? Hello. Ooh. What's he doing? What am I doing? Well, what's the cat doing? The cat is literally what she likes. She likes to sneer down at me by standing on top of the wardrobe and just staring. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. You want to continue? Yes. Go. You. You are not the witch. You are not Dallas. You sang the song. Now you must decide my fate. Are you to be my new master? <laughs> so it's Fireman Sam, an ancient lizard. I want to know more about who or what I'm speaking to before I make a decision. Ask. I am here to serve in all ways. Oh, careful now. Mm. Hey, hey. I remark that I sense great pain. The loss of a rich elven life and an afterlife torn apart and scattered through the Thank you, Jabari. Thank you. Warship. The bow of the ship creaks downwards on the swell of the ocean. In the breeze above you, the faintest hint of what might have been a melancholy sigh. Once. I was an elf. I passed away and was reborn as an ancestor tree in a beautiful forest surrounded by kin of both flesh and root. But that time has passed. I saw that forest reduced to a dead place. Then I was taken away. My memories were lost <laughs> like the leaves from my branches. Note that I heard that live wood only came from ancestor trees of the Elven homeland, but those forests were sacrificed in the wars of the previous generations. Sacrifice must be made willingly. Our home was stolen from us. Magic oh, destroyed our way of life to end the war they started. Then they uprooted me and... and they, they tore me apart and turned me into this. Monstrosity. Can I recommend we don't wind up our, our primary means of transportation? I'm, uh, I'm she this smells as well. <laughs> We've come to a decision. The creaking of the ship beneath you ceases, as if it were awaiting your decision with bated breath. Okay, party, what do we want to do? Uh, yeah. uh, well, we want to ride the ship to get out of here, so we got to ride the ship to get out of here. Something, yeah. something, Tortuga. I don't uh, know. I mean, I don't want to command this. I mean, that's thank you, Rilanko. a bit too thank much you. wood to handle for me. Look, you're an elf. Just, just, just play it level with her. Just like, look, come on. Gotta go. I, right. uh, to answer from the perspective of my character, I am no slaver. I wish for you to be free, and I hope that I will help you in return. You Do, are kind. <laughs> does the actual Kevin Puddle share a different <laughs> opinion? Not truly. I am a vessel and must be guided. Let me take you wherever you wish. We can depart as soon as you are ready. Aha, there we go. So we're good. Yep. All right, cool. So can we just like say to the ship, you know, fuck divinity, let's go on a world cool. That's the one. <laughs> you can fuck divinity. I want to be divine. I want to be... God, a... God woken on tour. Yeah. That's the one. I want to be <laughs> yeah. a god of, of, I don't know, fashion. I want to be a fashion god. god. So like, tour all the so stadiums. Well. Shut the fuck up. Go to arena. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can we get the, can we get t-shirts? Sort of source, source patrol. <laughs> Hang on a minute, I'm just gonna fiddle with the audio. Hang on. No I tried to become the vine, and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, hang on a minute. I'm just going to turn you guys down so that people can there turn the stream no up. Can you speak for a minute? Hello. Uh, hello. 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 Cool, there we go. Thank you. Loud noises. Um. Our sacred ancestor tree. Cool, I've just turned us all down so you can turn the game up, guys, if you want to hear the game. Right, now what? Oh, you're talking to Malady. I just need to turn this up. Dangerous waters lie ahead. Be sure you've chosen keen travel companions, or this may be your last chance to change your party. Yeah, I need to re-roll. Need to re-roll my teammates. <laughs> yeah, it's good. It's right. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Are we are we ready to are yes, we ready to proceed? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. Let's I go. My ascent. My it is time. Is forward. Ready. 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 With the sun on their backs and the wind in their sails, the god woke and watched Fort Joy shrink behind them. But their capture of the Lady Vengeance had not gone unnoticed.
Oh no! Oh yes, I remember this bit. Oh shit. Oh no, oh, shit. we're being attacked. Who could have expected this? You steal my ship. It's Dallas. Kill my bishop and my bishop, ally with kill Alexander. Demons. But you have no home. idea what you're really dealing with. I mean, clearly she's fine with it. Uh, she so, has, uh, so uh, she says uh, we have no idea who we're really dealing with. Uh, so you're trying to become the next divine. Uh, that guy next to you is Bracus Rex. Uh, with, <laughs> we can, we gotta do. <laughs> no, <laughs> we know everything. Oh, sorry, no, Matt, that's yeah. me sorry, that's meta gaming. Sorry, that's meta gaming. Meta gaming. An ancient scroll. Yeah, ancient scroll. The ancient scroll. It's not meta gaming, you know. <laughs> their, um, their, their ship is higher than us, and we can see under the cloak. This is de definitely oh, yeah. what's happening. Yeah. Also, yeah, the, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Anyway, so for the audience's benefit, our ship has been intercepted by uh, Dallas, who is the right-hand man, the right-hand lady. Of, uh, of Alexander, the leader of the Magisters. So I'm continuing. We are ready, mistress. Yes, but are they? I swear, mistress. I swear they'll perform admirably. <laughs> Very well. So what is actually Show the relationship the between goodbye, these two? Are they like sorcerers. kink buddies or something? Uh, I think he's enslaved, isn't he? Yes. yes. Yeah. Right. This is my ship. I, I mean, that could still be a king buddy, but... You act. Yes. Oh. There goes half the crew. Oh, for the love of the void. <laughs> Listen up. We can't win this one, but I can get us to safety. You'll need to buy me time. All right, I've got the gold. How much does Show it cost? Show us what you can do, Godwoken. All right. Godwoken. <laughs> Parasites, rather. I'll take care of it, mistress. Okay, here we go. You fight with such fire. Let's make it manifest. What's going on? Is the fight on? Her sorcery must think so. be silenced. Yep, the fight is on. Fight is on, right? Have you saved? Um well, I will now. Cool. Another quick save. Right. So reminded uh yeah, Digby, don't put out my ice. Don't put out the ice. Don't Got evaporate it. my ice. Don't evaporate the ice. Got it. Fire! Okay. Ah, fire, sir! To destroy all you've done! Clear minded! Ignition! Nice. Right, so I've been hit with a fiery malediction. Malediction. Uh -huh. Which means I'm going to blow up in the next couple of turns, so I want to make sure I'm in and amongst the enemy for when that happens. Right. Uh, for the most part, I am going to probably get myself fucking killed, to be honest, by jumping <laughs> into the mix, but no time like the present, hey? Yeah. Right, I'm going to jump in behind this guy here. Fantastic start. What an excellent opener we've just hit with there. Right, I'm going to go for chloroform on this guy. I'm then going to use petrifying touch on this guy. And then so I don't get fucking annihilated, I'm going to use chameleon cloak. Okay. So the silent monks don't have any magic armor. That's good, useful for me. Yes. Really useful for me as well. Yeah. So two guys though. I mean, they could be a pain. Yes, so I'm going to try Thank and you, go for the guys Thank so you. I can lock them down. All right, I'm going to tactical retreat up here. Good plan. We should level up and in this fight. Cool. And elf home. Ah. Uh. And blood arrows. Arrows of blood. <laughs> oh no! Wait, sorry. It's no physical armor. They don't have any physical oh. armor. The silent monks. No, no, no. There's That's... some silent monks. The two next to me have no magic. Okay. And, so, and some of them have no physical. It's a mix. So what are we focusing on? Sorry. For the moment, um, just the tightest club for you and Digby. It's all about getting the best out of your AOE. Yeah. So the tightest I'm clusters. Gonna... Oh, yeah. Messi will switch targets depending on how well you do against yours as finishes. Yeah, I'm gonna good... do this silent monk that has no physical armor because it's gonna hit him properly. Okay. I don't know whether you woke up the. Uh... Yeah, well, yeah, I wasn't expecting it to bounce backwards, honestly. Fed it. I'm hoping it'll And I'll here. end my turn there. Okay, this silent watcher's heading up there. Oh god, high ground damage. Oh, dear. That's gonna be that's gonna be nasty. Ow. Yep, knew it. Okay, Can't so he fucking half health me. Right, in which case I'm going to cut no standby. First things first. 
It's going to put rain down on me and also put out some of the fire, but mostly I just need the water. Now that I'm standing in the water, my spells will have a reduced cost. I'm going to then reach up and put Shackles of Pain on the Silent Watcher up there. There we go. Linking us together. Then what can I do with an Ice Fan? So I've got two more action points. Who's got no magic armor? I can't freeze the Silent Watcher because they're petrified, right? I think they yes, all have right. magic armor, but the one below you has rather low one, the weaponized monk. Uh, that's true. Tell you what, I'm going to use... Ah, oh, I know what I'm going to do. Hang on. Winter Blast on that big cluster over there, which shouldn't affect Quebec because it doesn't hit allies. Might be able to hit lots of them. Hang on. Yeah, hang on. Watch this. Winter Blast. Very nice. That's nice. what it's all about. Yes. Okay, and then lastly, how are we doing? Um, you're quite hurt, aren't you, Kevin? Um, uh, he had him half health. Would you I like a help. hot? Yes, please. All right, here comes a hot for you, sir. Restoration. Thank you, sir. Right, game on. I wonder if you can actually get up to it. Thank you, Dallas. Kaiser and Aratu and uh, Rulanko. Thank you, all of you. Thank you kindly. All oh, right, we have to protect the lady. Melody. Oh yes, Critics. of course, because she's yeah, she's casting the thing to escape to the void. Oh god. Oh dear. Oh Christ! Ow. Wow, you're hurt. Okay. They're going for Malady. Going, gonna go try and get in there and help her. Yeah. I need better armor. I've only got 52 <laughs> armor. Do it. 52 army, 52 armor. Hold them off. I need more time. Jason. You will not take me again. Oh, oh, we're getting a buff. Oh. We're getting a buff. Yeah, the shift, but the shift, the shift, the shift. Oh, vengeance. Oh wow. The lady vengeance used vengeance. Who knew? Oh, wow. Hey. Plus eight constitution. Wow. That's not bad. Nice. Thank you, lady. Plus eight wits. I like this shit. Nice. It's like the Ebon Hawk, but better. Spontaneous combustion! Do you have to yell that every time you cast that? Yes. Right. It's the law. Yeah, okay. The law. Uh, right, if I do damage, Shackles of Pain works both ways, right? Uh, Pretty sure. No, 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 just to no, the target way. shackled, yeah. Yeah, so hit that. Yeah, hit her. Shouldn't hurt me. All right. Well, I'm going to take him off the high ground, and I'm going to deposit him yeah. basically on the ground. You do. Yeah, I'll, cool. I'll watch my health. I'm going to throw him over here. Cool. Nice yeah, one. I'm unaffected. And then these three are all standing close together. Fire! Mm -hmm. To destroy all you've done! Nice. Thank you, Shry7. Yeah, Thank you, Shry. Blow. Much appreciated, Shry. Thank you. Yeah, it's going in for that magic damage as well. Well, they're super I've clustered. Ex I've exploded. <laughs> um, they're just, just, yep, just normal day at the office. Yeah. Um, I'm going to go for a backstab on this silent watcher. Not good, but not terrible. I am then going to go for a battle stomp on all three of them. Oh, nice, very nice. One uh, misses, two we go focus down. the mobs next to Malady? Yeah. If you, yeah, use our AOE on that group, but otherwise we need to protect Malady. Yeah. Okay. I am going to barrage on the the guys. Or, yeah. Mm -hmm. Watch out for the fire behind Malady. The, the yes. oil. Yeah, I'm just going to keep shooting on the guys. Uh, he's okay. just running for the high ground. That's yeah. the one. <laughs> okay. <Make up> <laughs> All right, what have I got around me? So Silent Monk there with no magic armor. That one's already downed. Um, do, 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 do. do you have physical armor there, small hands? I do, yes. Okay, I might do this. Sorry, hang on. I'm going to use Infect against this target. Ooh. Fantastic. There we Good go, hit. which will spread. Nice. Nice. Okay, with a single action point remaining... Uh, you could use some magic armor there, Quebec. Yes, I will that would be very nice. I will remedy the situation. Thank armor you very frost. Much, there you go. Yeah, I've got to go over there. I need more time. I'll get over there. Oh, oh god, the other guy. Whoop! 156 damage. Shit. 
Oh no, now you've been diseased, sorry. It's all good. Fuck their honor. Ow. Ow. I, li I like how that's just a bloke, it's not a dog, it's just a bloke. Yeah. Oh, she's <laughs> been diseased. She doesn't have much left in her. Shit, we've got to go save her. I'm bleeding and I'm yeah. diseased, but it's going to kill. Okie dokie. Uncanny evasion as this dog fucker behind me will not piss off. Uh, my clear minded runs out, so I can get myself out again. Mm -hmm. Lovely. And I'll throw a rock at these two over here. Uh, guys, we do need to help my list. Yeah, my I'm on the way. I'm on my way. I need to go over there. Curse you on the curse. Gun. Trying to curse the water. Okay. Right. So I'm pretty badly hurt. Thank, yeah, you, Thank you, Sturminus. Thank you, kindly Sturminus. That I can for such an eventuality. Um, in terms of crowd control, I don't really have anything yet. Nothing. No hard crowd control. Mm. Um, yeah, I'm not really going to be able to do too much on this turn. I'm gonna go to here and then just go for a spin, I think. Oh, I've been at. Oh, oh that's yeah. not good. Okay. Didn't see his attack of opportunity through the particle effects. Um, oh, shit. That's not good at all. Right, can I kill her? Oh. No. Didn't, didn't kill. Oh, for some reason. Okay, their backstab isn't in the... Okay, weird. Orientation's off. Um, I'm going to have to just heal myself. Yeah. Do you not have a potion? I do have a potion. I'll go for a, that one of those. Yeah, that'd be more efficient. I've got a hot now as well. <laughs> <laughs> I love it when they fall over. Alright, like so, I'm going to finish off the monk. As soon as you make to Driftwood, that will be a lot better off. It's just that gives there. me two extra AP. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna use an enchanting arrow on the weaponized monk, which the fuck all. What's it supposed to do? Oh, there we go. What does it do? What brings He's it on to our side shaman? Or... Got it. Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Oh god. Oh. Dog's been healed. Okay, my turn. Um, so I'm going to move. Damn, it'll take three action points. I'm going to use three action points to move closer and get in this patch of ice. Not ideal, but I, didn't, I need to do something. Now, are you. Cl oh, you're. At, damn it, you're just out of range. Okay, no, okay, I can move for zero. Good. Right, so now I'm going to cast Soothing Cold, which will steadily restore your. Oh wait, you've already got magic armor. Of course, because I put shell on you. I'm done. I've done goofed. Hang on. I will encourage then. Yeah. And then be in a better position next turn to fight and assist Malady. She should last. Okay. Thank you, Sackle Burns. Turns. Thank you very much, Sackle Burns. Two more turns until we're free. I think so. Just oh, gonna make it that far. Yeah. Oh, she might not make that. So for the chat's benefit, Malady is trying to cast um, a mass teleport spell. Of a kind. Yeah, I, I want to heal Thank you, Rio. Got Thank you. On her. Yeah. Shit. Focus. Stop her sorcery. We're basically oh, trying to make a warp jump. A little longer. Just a little <laughs> longer. Yeah, she's trying to activate the ship's Geller field to pull us into the warp. Okie dokie, I need to get myself close to this action. Ah, fuck. I wanted some damage, but I can't. I really want to try out if first aid removes decaying, but uh, I'm scared of killing her at this point. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't what risk about it. Bless? Yeah, but we need, we need to do something Bless to help her. Do it. Bless will do it. Can, anyone got source? Yeah, we don't have nope. source. Uh, Blew it all on the fight with Alexander. 
no, 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 no. Moving is the priority. I might be able to to pull something out of the hat. Oh, oh fuck. fuck! Sorry, fuck. sorry. Hell. My eyes. Oh. Sorry. I need it. Right. I'm going to try and pull something out of the hat. Um, I'm going to. Yeah. Oh, I'm go the keying is gone. The keying. The keying is gone. Buffs. Sweet. Yeah. Hang on. I'm going to jump to here. Right. I'm going to use adrenaline rush. I'm going to move one step this way. I'm going to try and cripple this Geist for as much damage as I can, which misses. That is Shit. extremely bad. Um, not terrible. Pretty terrible. How much health has she got? She might be okay. Maybe. I'm going to step here for one AP, and I'm going to knock down as many as I can. Oh, no, I can't. can't. I'm still on, what? still on cooldown. Oh, okay. I can only put one of them to sleep. No, it's not going to okay. be good enough. How are you guys on, you know, cooldowns on, like, heals and... Two turns uh, away. Armor. Two turns. I, if you first aid me, I can fortify Malady. Gives them more armor and more constitution. But you've got to first aid me and pick me up, because otherwise I'm going to lose my turn. Yeah, um... But before you get your turn again, at least five mobs get it. Thank yeah. you, the Termin Asian. Thank I you very much, Termin. I need to focus on Melody right. first. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, first aid on Melody. Nice. And I have a restoration scroll, which I really didn't want to use yet, but... No, it's better, better. Now's the time. Now is the time. Yeah. Nice, it's a hot as well. And a knockdown arrow on the guys to see if we can... No, well yeah, done. Yeah. Might be enough. That that should be enough to keep her All going in. for a bit. Oh Christ! Oh, oh no, that's a devastating hit. Yeah. Um. Right. Can I reach from there? I can. Stand by. I can actually hit all of them with an AOE, but it's just damage, really. Um. Hang on. Just looking at my options. Okay. I'm just gonna DPS. Here we go. So first, Winter Blast. Chill block to Belito got critical hit. Followed up hit, by. What? Hang on. Try and hit the dog. The dog? The hound. It's chilled, so you will stun it if you right. freeze it again. I will hit two hits there. Right, here comes an ice fan. Nice. There we go. Froze one. Damage the others. It's not going to be enough. I'm hoping one of them switches targets. Okay, and then I'm going to... Fuck, hang on. That's all I got. That's all I got. Everything else is on cooldown. Well, now we find out whether she lives or not. Shit. Yeah, he's going for me. Oh, Perfect. Nice. Come on, Malady, cast it. Thank you, Big Billy, and Panda, and Cunning Stunts. Thank you. Crippling blow wasn't that heavy. Thank you, guys. Thank you, all of you. Yep, I think we'll be all right. She must be stopped. Cast it, Malady. Yes. Yes. Not close at all. No. Swell. With the help of a half demon, Malady. The demon, god yeah. woke and escaped through the veil that separates life from death. Okay, we've entered the warp. Right, here the we are. here has a familiar smell, like the place you grew up. Old memories begin to well within you, but the sweet sour smell of decay suddenly punctures them. You're in my conversation, yeah? Yes, uh, oh. this, this is no time for such distractions. Uh, I look around and realize that I've been here before. A faint yeah. creaking sounds in the distance. I shake off the smell of death. I wish to remember. I see. Is we had independent conversations. Tree? What's hanging from Yeah. It? Ah, here we are. So, for the audience's let's, sake... Let's just find a way back to the ship. We were here right. briefly before where we met our god, effectively. Oh, hang on. We can level up. That's more important. Yep, just done that. Haha. <laughs> okay. Sorry. What do I want? Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. Okay. Right, so yes, uh, we met our individual uh, patron gods for each of our species. 
and it appears that they are here, caught up in a giant tree. Is this a shared conversation? Oh no, but yeah, I see, we talk to our individual gods. Hang on. Right, so just gonna mute myself. So where's the human god? God of the lizards, god of the elves, god of the orcs, god of the dwarves. There he is, Raliac. Here's my god. Or rather, a god that appears to be human. Raliac hangs limp from the tree, cursed branches constricting him, snake-like from foot to shoulders. His helmeted head hangs slack at his side, but a barely audible wheeze rasps from his lips. Hurry! Hurry, he says. Raliac hangs limp, his helmeted head... Hurry! Uh, did the other one speak? Hurry. Before you hangs a great ethereal orc, his face twisted in a knot of pain as cursed tendrils constrict him. Hurry. Are we supposed to bless him? Is that what we're supposed to do? Hang on. Get rid of the shackles, get bless. As the cursed branches slither away from Ralic, he raises his head. Green eyes glint with sudden fire from behind his helmet. Are we the first? The others, do they hang still upon the tree? He strains at the ethereal ropes that bind him, resisting their grip. You must make haste. I am bound, but not defeated. Not yet. What happened here? How did the Seven come to such fate? This is not the work of fate. It is the work of the void. It will come for our people. It will destroy us all. You are my chosen. Now you must become the champion of our kind. The champion of humanity. I have survived our enemies. You must do more than that. Where do I begin? You have already unleashed some of the powers locked within you. But there is a great well of possibility still untapped. You cannot stop until you ascend to the highest heights of your power. You cannot stop until you become divine. So it's worth noting to the audience, just speaking to Twitch, is that each of the each of my party members are also being groomed by their own god to become the divine, a messiah figure, effectively, um, who is going to sort of lead the world to freedom. And obviously all the gods are in competition with each other. Uh, consider this, he wants me to become the next Lucian then. Lucian was the last divine. Like Lucian. What? You will be called to unite the powers of the Seven against the Void. <laughs> Different voice actor. Like Lucian, you will lead our proud people to preeminence. But unlike Lucian, your weakness will not lead you to foolish failure. I will not fail you. He opens his mouth to respond, but stops and tilts his head, listening for something you cannot detect. I hear the Void. I hear it calling. I hear it laughing. It, it's coming. It's here. If it finds you here, if it finds you. Ralik's face twists in fear. He opens his mouth as if to scream, but no sound comes out. White hot cold pierces your heart like a blade. You are frozen to the spot. The burning cold pumps through you like a curse, and then... He teleported me away. So something is happening to the gods, effectively. The seven gods are being drained by what they call the Void. And it seems they're all grooming a champion. A Godwoken, someone who is a sort of, um, I suppose a sort of, uh, what's the term? Like a, like a Nazkant? Is, is that, yeah, as in like a, like a, uh, well, I suppose a, a divine in training, really. A, uh, you know, a person who is about to ascend. Calls that I need to get from Driftwood. I've got the finances. Hello. I need Hello. to get them. Well, Hello. I'm done with my god. Lovely. When you're ready, meet us down by the respect mirror to progress. Shall do. Okay. What happened to the crew? Um, well, this, they've... It would appear that we were blasted into the Hall of Echoes and they did not survive the trip into oblivion. Oh yeah, here they are. <laughs> 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 Everyone's dead. Uh, <laughs> fuck em. Well, they're not. They're not the next divine, and I am. Clearly not. Sorry. I mean, uh, <clears throat> hi, hail, party members. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. Teamwork. Uh, so I, I just, I got really dizzy there, and, and I just woke up on the deck. I don't know, don't know what happened. Didn't just have a conversation with uh, God. 
No. Well, I'm not being groomed to to succeed as the next divine. You, you definitely are being groomed. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> I shall point on the doll to show to show everyone the where one. the god touched me. That's the one. The god touched me in my source. <laughs> right. Okay. This, uh, honestly, cats are the worst. Like, literally, you open the door to let them out, close the door, and no sooner is it closed, <laughs> do they want to come back in? <clears throat> Yo, Soviet, why aren't you playing with the ZF clan anymore? That's ZF Quebec. That's ZF Digby. I always play with the ZF Clan. Whenever you see me playing with people, it's probably the ZF Clan. How was the 15 seconds that you were gone? Hello. Hey, is Satan a boy or a girl? Right. Are we talking about okay. the cat? Yeah. What are we talking no. about? No, 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 the evil entity. What? So the cat? Uh, yeah, is, is Satan a boy or a girl? <laughs> That's an obvious question. Satan's a girl. Of, of course, course it is. She is. <laughs> uh. <laughs> right, are we ready? Yes. Wait one. He's gone into the mirror. Uh. <clears throat> da, 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 da. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I have to read this one to you guys. Um, so I just got a question in the chat. Why don't you uh -huh. play... Uh, hang on, sorry, what, what was it? But why don't you play with real ZF clan members? Whoa! <laughs> okay, what? Apparently you two, so Quebec, who's been around since like the, sorry, that's PMC Quebec, you realize, from fucking, yeah, the, yeah fucking this... Days Evil shittery, like part fucking whatever. Okay, I and will admit, I'm a little bit of a dick little... come lately. Well, no, but you've been, been here for more than a year. For a fucking year. Yeah. <laughs> but who, who the fuck said no, that? No, no, you're not. You're not. Neither of you are real ZF. No, no. Hold on, hold on. Who, who said that? <laughs> no, I'm not gonna tell you. You can either ban them, leave them. Real ZF. Uh, see, see, you've offended them. Hold on, hold on. Who was it? <laughs> who fucking was it? Rat him out, chat. No, on, no, no, no. Let's pr let's proceed. Come on. Rat him out. Go on. Don't rat him, rat him out. out. Leave it. Come on. Oh, Me have you guys all put nails on your shoes yet? <laughs> oh no, I can't find nails. You need some nails. Yeah. I've Go got on. a spare nails. Go on. Go Can't on, mention him. I've got, I've got fucking time. <laughs> I'll <laughs> wait. Real ZF, you know. <clears throat> right. Need that, like, autistic, like, Spongebob meme. Maybe I should play some PUBG. <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. All right, okay. Uh, shall, we, shall we move on? Yes, yes. Right, let's so just, let's just Let's just progress. Conflab. Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. That was quick. Yes. Thank you, Sir Benjamin. Thank you very much. Okay. Right. Uh, I would say I'm ready. I'm, we're ready. Yep, we're ready. Brace yourself. This might hurt a lot. Ready. 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 Exit the wall. 18,000 XP. This tranquil fucking coast has been about to be devastated by a tsunami. <laughs> get it by. The chill of the Hall of Echoes clung to the Lady Vengeance as it returned to the shores of Reaper's Coast. That would make a larger wave than the that. The Godwoken were alive, but what of the gods? Indeed, the gods appear to be struggling. <clears throat> also, it, sorry, I, I can hear the sound of, of 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 vendors crying for their lost gold, Quebec. Sorry, I, I can from here off off the coast. I can hear the sound of vendors crying. That's the one. Yeah, the the <laughs> all the merchants are like, oh fuck, it's them. <laughs> Not Thank you, guys. Again. Thank you. In very the much. middle of a town somewhere is a town cry. Beware! <laughs> ZF the is small here. Small hand <laughs> Brutus approaches. Lock up your vaults. Yeah. Sell your valuables. Yeah. For it is a well thief. <laughs> can, can we limit the thievery in the market just for, just for the sake of it? It's a fucking pain. Can can we define limit? Can we define <laughs> limit? <laughs> the the answer is no. Thank right. you. Thank right. you. We, we need community. to be able to sell stuff and get something in return. Uh, well, I mean, you can haggle item for item. Quirkus, what mm -hmm. do you make of this? Oh, God. Hang on. <laughs> oh, Quirkus. Right. So we're back. Oh, she's going to do the vomit thing. Oh, don't. 
Okay. As your eyes adjust, you realize you're still aboard the Lady Vengeance. A gust of fresh sea air caresses you, and warm sunshine prickles your skin. <coughs> oh, one moment, please. Charming. Oh, just a moment. Melody explodes in a fit of retching that racks her brain. Don't! No, oh, it's revolting! <laughs> Did you just drink up what she just puked out? <laughs> it wriggles quickly I off the siding. You are foul. I eat bodies. Do you really expect a, standards here? Let's not do that again anytime soon. Mm. Not. I'm, I'm that's up an for easy work. deal. Very good. I'll feel far less put upon if you tell me you learned something useful on our little field trip. Um, I'm not really sure to be honest. I met one of the gods again, or my god, and they seemed pretty desperate, if I'm honest. Desperate? How? For a shag. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, they just really uh, need to. Hello, be darling. Yeah. Uh, hey, how you doing? I yeah. see. So, so, your god seemed uncharacteristically frightened, told you the void was coming, and that only you could ascend to divinity, after which you felt a cold deep within you. Well then, it sounds like you need to ascend, doesn't it? And quickly. She inspects her fingers with great tension. Am I the only one who's not that worried about then godhood? Then looks up at you from under an arched eyebrow. Well, you know, it's a promotion. Yeah, I just so want to go my, back to my, my farm. <laughs> my cold really doesn't feel that deep. Think, think about all the things you could grow on your farm, though, with divinity. Ooh, now could, like, there's a click thought. Click your fingers. Like, you could grow turnips. Like, really big turnips. Golden turnips. Golden Ooh, turnips. Ooh, really big turnips. You could grow, okay, you could grow plants that make meat. Ooh, meat plants. Yeah. Didn't they do that? Like they like like grew a burger patty with like I can't remember that. Did, did, am I talking like they? Like, <laughs> Is like, it that they, like SpongeBob well, like, SquarePants like, or something? Like, no, it was like some like they did it. It was like with, with like this bacteria or this fungus. They like grew like what is essentially a corn burger or something. Oh yeah. It's like and it was like someone like was like pa like it was like it took them years to grow this burger, a Franken burger. Uh, right. Oh, I. What did it they grow on? A ham bush? It took them years <laughs> to grow it, and then when they finally had enough of this, you know, substance to actually make a patty, they obviously made it, and someone ate it. And I could just imagine, she was like, oh, yes, it tastes like the real thing, and I could just imagine See? in the back of her mind, like, going, ah! <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, they, you can grow them on a ham bush. The only problem is you never know when they're going to fully ripen. Yes. Anyway. What? Did they anyway. mention a ham how bush. meant to become the next divine? Ham Never mind. So He's, I've ambush. Got it. I got it. Oh, okay, right. Oh, this wasn't god. funny. Oh my god, you you were killed in the ambush. Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, right. So uh, Malady wants us to be the next divine as well. Me. Yes. Me. Um. Say. Uh. Say you understood you were meant to grow your powers, but you're. Thank you, Virtroy. Sure Thank you very much. What confidence you inspire. Yes. Yes. It's what the parents say. Luckily um, for you, Mama Malady is here. Mama today. Malady. Mama, oh, Mama, Mama, Mama Malady. Malady. We already know Mama you can Malady. Bless, but as far as I know, you can neither see source nor take it as you see fit. I know, I was just fine. I may not know much about divinity, but I do know that any god woken worth their salt will know how to perform all these oh so fantastic feats. No, I'm getting a little bit of sore. Thank, Thank you, Mora. Thank Appreciate you very much. Thank you. Turn that down, keep it to a minimum. You need to go see the Meister. The Meister. Ask where I can find this Meister. Oh, she's got Normally a large town with a chain around their know, neck. Building oh, where God. people go and they do things inside of it. Um, home, that's it. She's got a home in Driftwood. I was thinking a brothel, but that makes sense. Give me your map. Hmm. There you are. Tell her I sent you and she'll handle the rest. You're at the beginning of a long journey, Godwoken. Long, but exceedingly interesting. How long? Well, if I was to summarise it, I'd say three acts, but who yep. knows. <laughs> now, I must be going, and so must you. Very well. I shall mm -hmm. take my leave. I shall ask no, no more. Before you go, if I'm well, not back you. by the time you find out where our journey takes us next, you can call me back here. Tell the ship. She'll know how to summon me. Thank you, Finn. And Thank you very much. in likely case, you don't manage to do whatever it is you'll need to do to become what you need to become. You could call me, but I would be grateful if it doesn't come to that. Lovely. Right, okay. okay. So, Driftwood! 
This fucker wants to talk to me, the squirrel. Oh let me God. Let me check, let me check <gasps> in. Do we have to talk to the squirrel? Yes. Ugh. Hi there, Mega sh uh, sh sh Shady. Right. Thank you, Mega. Jesus Christ. Excellent. Right. What if it's too late, hmm? What if the Knights of Dre are too far ahead in their plans? The Knights of Dre? Yeah, I, sorry, I didn't even know that was an option then. I was actually curious. The Knights of Dre? Who are they? At least here, our shield's ignorance can be forgiven, hmm, Quirkus. The Knights of Dre do not go out of their way to boast about their existence. You know their order, my friend. Mystic Squirrel Knights. Sworn to the Great Acorn. You talk about the Black Trying to bring about its what? return. The squirrel absent-mindedly runs a paw over Quirkus's spine. The air fills with the sound of soft, dusty purring. They plan to inherit the everlasting forest once the acorn drops and the world is rid of all giants. They believe that only the arboreal will and should survive. Okay. How he's, do you, he's talking about yeah. the Black Ring, isn't he? I think so. Fuck's sake. Ask how he intends to combat such a nefarious plan. I... I don't know. I am trying, of course. But how does one battle a power like the Great Acorn? The Knights of Dre are a dangerous, dangerous order. Lunatics with a single-minded devotion to bringing about the end of the world. Okay. Together, Quercus, we can develop some magic to save us from the Great Acorn if our shield can keep us alive. Bit late, so, man. No. <laughs> bit, bit late. Says the uh, spectral entity that's yes. long dead. Yes, yes, it has done an admirable job so far. It certainly lasted longer than I thought it would. But does it understand that we could be wiped out at any moment? Does it understand the risk? Um. No, roll your eyes. No, you, you want the entire speech from the start. It's an idiot, Quirkus. <laughs> it's not wrong. Still, it would be a shame to see any harm come to it. Here's a little something I uncovered in my research. The squirrel reaches out and touches your ankle, sending a hot flush rippling through your body. Your mind's eye sees new potential spells swirling before it. Huh. Now listen carefully, Shield. The plan is thus. Do. No. Die. <laughs> Do no if die. If the Shield can hold up its end of the bargain, we might just have a chance to complete our research. We might make it yet, Quirkus. Wonderful. What, what spell did it give you? Mm. Um, I, I don't know. There we go. Bleed, bleed fire. Bleed fire. Bleed fire? What the hell is bleed uh, fire? I think I need that. Oh, yeah, he needs that. Well, it's only the ability to craft the recipe. Like, uh, it's a crafting recipe uh. as opposed to the actual book. All right. We'll still need to acquire it. Right, off to the yes. lifeboat. Then. Yes, to the lifeboat. Let's, Let's go. Let's make it to shore. Yes, I, I look forward to this bit. Let's... Oh, Willow, what are you doing? Nails. I see nails. Oh. What's oh. that? Who's Willow? The cat. Sorry, yeah, that's the cat's actual name. Oh, not Satan. No. Oh, you should have called it Satan. Uh, well, you know, I didn't have any, you know, fucking pentagrams to hand. <laughs> right. I'd left Ooh, my summoning salt in my other pants. Yeah, yeah, we've got a conversation with Tarquin over here by the life lifeboat. I'm going to remark that many aboard this ship died during recent ordeals. How is it that you survived? Uh, thank Why you, Marker Zero, I think. Who spared me. Thank she you kindly, the Marker. of some use yet. Rather flattering to enjoy the favour of such a powerful being. Uh, what have you heard about me? Because you said you heard something before. That you're, uh, how did Malady put it again? A godwoken. Yes, that's it. Quite remarkable, if it's true. Uh, does this alter your opinion of me? Tarquin pauses, taking you in. Genial smile and calculating eyes. Most people are too sentimental to admit that friendship is a transaction. I am not. I'm sure we can both be of use to each other. I think I'll decide that for myself, Sunshine. If Tarquin is offended, it doesn't register on his face. I'm sure you'll come to warm to me. Consider my full attention yours whenever you need it. Right, I'd like to do some trading if you didn't lose all your shit in the Hall of Echoes. 
Right, what have you got? That's, that's new. Trading. Uh, that's pretty fucking good. Okay. Right. I'm itching to get to shore, to be honest. Yes. Because my Ta Phoenix We will have an opportunity there. to uh, fucking um, trade with Tarquin later. We do meet up with him. Oh, I already 30% of the next level. We've yes. done fuck all. Major questing. Major quests. Hmm? Handed in. Oh all my good. god, all this shit's so like, fucking expensive. Jesus Christ. Why is he problem. asking for it? Come on, get like in the damn two boat. grand. Oh, crap. We gotta... Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. We've got to fight oh, our yes. way there, haven't we? Thank you, the combat wombat. Thank you, dude. Thank you. Right. You guys nothing... coming? Yes, sorry. Just, uh... Yeah, nothing. I might come back for his masterwork runes later. Take your leave. Right, onto the shore. Right, so we've arrived off the coast of Driftwood, that town. Wait, stay together. Who are we waiting on? There's Messi? poisoned fish. Sorry. Oh, there's a way shrine over here. Oh, go activate it. Cool, we're together. Yes. Right, so we need to there find our way to Hold Driftwood. It. So for the sake of the audience, we're here to find a ma maester. Uh, Meister, yeah. Meister. Meister, who will assist us in our ascension to Godwokenness. Um... Godhood. So yeah. So let's head into town. Poisoned fish. Stealthily, because we are a bunch of escaped prisoners. Wait, yes. who just took that starter's herb? Not me. Why are we sneaking? Would would you like it? Yeah. Okay, pardon, why? why are we sneaking? Because uh, it's said for making wings. Oh. Ah, okay. Hold on. Eh. Sweetie, have some flowers. I love you. There you go. Da, 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 da. Ooh, nearby. Just picking up some right. herbs. Oh, hang on. Is this the bridge into Driftwood? Yeah, over no, here. No, is no, it? no, no, no. It's it? further up the road. What's this? There's a, there's a small boy over here with a bridge. Oh, this is, um, yeah, let's go and talk to this because this is the thing, isn't it? Hang on. <gasps> Woo! Woo! You there, small boy! There's dinner all over these roads. Oh dear. Okay, we're in a conversation. Hang on, over here. Oh. Yeah. Wait for them. Wait for them. Wait for them. Are you all right? Ma. Just messy now. There we go. Yeah. Those will squint across the river, looking for the boy's mother. A screech like metal dragging on stone grinds from across the river. You have to help her, please. Where's his hair? You can't see her. She's in the house, and those things are all around. Void things. Mm -hmm. uh, I might be maybe, able to help, but a... I need to know what happened here first. There was a a fight. Some dwarves attacked some magisters, and there were sorcerers too. And, and then the bugs came. Those void things. They killed everyone. And my mom got them to chase her. And she went across the bridge. And then she raised the bridge. And, and, and she told me to run. And now she's stuck over there with them. Uh, your mother did what she did to protect you. You should go and seek shelter like she told you. Not without Ma. Family doesn't just leave each other. There's a different ethic in their family to mine. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're going to get yourself killed. Your mother will wanna go, you, want you to go somewhere safe. If those things get to Ma, they can get to me too. Yeah, if you... Oh. That's a fair point. What? No, it's not. You should run. Right, I will do everything I can to help your mother. Maybe... Maybe you can cross the river then. Ma lifted the bridge, but there's got to be another way, right? Okay. If there is a way, I'll find it. And if there isn't a way, I'll bloody well make one. Yeah. Yeah. You'll make one. And I'll... I'll... Hide. His gaze shoots Bro to the ground. Hair. He grabs a small flat pebble and chucks it across the river. Again, it lands in the water below, well before reaching the other side of the cliffs. I'll keep distracting him. <laughs> okay. Noting the void worker. Thank you, Inquay. Thank you. You keep doing what you're doing, son. He performs <laughs> a divine order salute. Now go out, Ma. Thank you very much, Ink. Thank you kindly. Fantastic. All right. So his mother's trapped on the other side with yeah, void woken. With void woken. So that's gonna go well. Yeah. Uh, so, we're gonna move move around. Yeah, come yes, back round. Haven't we? Go. we right. shall follow this road. I've got very limited mouse movement because the cat has fallen asleep oh, on my no. forearm. Aww. Cute. 
Oh yeah. wow, there's a Dinner. fucking Dinner. Oh, dead shit over here. Uh, a firm, dead shit. Yeah. Yeah. De dead dwarf, lots of dwarves. There's a dwarven war maiden here. Oh, I'll talk to her. She's my people. Oh, fuck. What's happened? That's it. Right. Hey, isn't that messy? From the last yeah. playthrough? Yeah, it's messy. Oh, it is. Yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> same hairstyle, same colour. Back. Get back. I'll kill you, just like the rest of them. Oh, it's just as brave as me, too. I look at the carnage all around me and I say, I doubt your little knife could have done all of that. Thank you, Swag. Thank you. Very much. Draining from her. No, 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 no. I've never seen anything like those beasts before. Are, are they gone? Certainly seems like everybody is gone, all right, one way or another. Her eyes widen and lose focus, as though she's seeing something played out before them. Her voice is shaky when she speaks. Those, yes, worst ones I've ever seen. Ripped through the magisters, the dwarves, dead, dead, dead. And the sorcerers, sorcerers, gone. Sorcerers? There are no sorcerer bodies here. What happened to them? Her eyes stare vacantly into the distance, glassy as marbles. It's not cold, yet her shivering is relentless. I, I don't know. I don't know, old Doolas Beard. Loha, my b -b boss Loha will want to know what happened to them, but I I can't remember. She's in shock. What? What? What were you doing for this boss, Loha? For helping the sorcerers. We, we, we thought we could help them against the Magisters, but... but... Thank you, Swag Dragon. Right. Thank you, Commander. You're safe now, for the moment, anyway. She flinches at the slightest Thank you, Cynic. Of wind Thank you, Cynic. Grass. Terror in her eyes. She stumbles away from you. So, wait. They were transporting right. sorcerers to help them, and one of them summoned a bunch of. Uh, summoned a bunch of Void Woken by the sound of it. Just excuse me as I go collect lunch on the floor floors. here, okay? Oh, God. Uh, sure. I think I, I, I do actually have some extra. Hang on. Look. Oh, actually, if you eat them, you'll be All able right. to tell us what happened, yeah. won't you? Yeah. Now, where's my inventory? There, I've got, some, it. I've got some extra bits uh, for later ooh. if you want to. Ooh, ooh, lunch. Um, hang on a minute. Um, so I've got a pair of boots which are 14 physical armor, 9 magic armor, but requires finesse 12. Anyone? Yep, I'll be alright. Not for me. And I've got a pair of uh, wizard leggings, third, so it requires intelligence 12, 33 magic armor, 6 physical armor. Please. I've got some story here. Sorry, was that a yes from you, Messi? Yes, please, what? from the magician. All right, to Kevin. Kevin no, I'm just eating some, you know, right. bodies. Oh, you got a conversation? All right. Yeah. What's going on? Hang on. Listening. It, it's only this, but... Collared by magisters no, right. in the far north, you were forced marched to this foreign land. A moment of hope as a grinning dwarf removes your source color. Seconds later, void will condemn. Oh, Jesus. So the moment they removed the source color... Uh, nice. Let's try some other parts. Lovely. Well, you gonna read it? Uh, you remember a cold childhood in a no-hope fishing town, bullied mercilessly by a dwarf named Lohor. With no other prospects, you sign up as a magister, eager for the power you denied you all your life. Oh fuck! So maybe it was instigated by a magister who had a chip on his shoulder about Lohar. Uh. Jesus. Work, work, work. That's all there was in Driftwood for a dwarf like you, until you got involved in the anti magister resi resistance. Then the work was still there, but also purpose. Purpose worth dying for. So Lohar's uniting the dwarves together under one one order. <coughs> I could get behind that. Mm. Alright. Uh. Gonna read it? From the dark, you stare up at the thin slivers of light visible between the floorboards. Shadows ripple across the slivers, accompanied by heavy footsteps. Magister footsteps. Wood creaks above your oh. head. One of them has paused. Your breath catches in your throat as you wait for him to move along. But the hatch is suddenly yanked open. Light floods you, blinding and accusatory. You hear only one gruffly barked word before the hands seize you. Gotcha. Oof. Wait, so, hang on. You, oh. ju you just ate a piece of the sorcerer? Uh, so I the sorcerer's so. dead? 
You just take yeah. a I also them. forgot I still have two heads to eat. Ah, okay. Uh, warm red wine flows down your throat. Languor of a tavern evening suits you. Suddenly shrieks rent the night. The magisters have come. Warm red blow, blood flows down your face. Oh, they are fucking tyrants. And one more. You twist your head around as the magisters haul you away. Your wife and two boys stand in the doorway, helpless. You commit their faces to memory one last time. Mm. People being Let's dragged continue. away. Let's continue. Let's continue. Don't. Don't. Oh, my bad. Don't. Yep. Wendy cries out something to you. You tell yourself it was, I love you, or we'll wait for you. But the truth is, you didn't catch it. The farm recedes from view behind That's you. a bit close to the nail for me. Oh. Yeah. From your farm. Have you saved it yeah. for that? Yeah, I'll save it now. Yeah, I could really get behind an anti-magister resistance after yes. reading that. Mm. Fucking so could I. Red, red fucking sleeved bastard. Let's do him in. Yeah, and we let the blind guy live. Oh. Ooh. Okay, the blind Ooh. guy was no threat to anyone anymore. I don't, I don't believe. Actually, he could have. He could have. He, he, he oh, was. Geez. He had a wagon just like this. Sweet, sweet. <laughs> found more food apparently. Okay. I've got, I've got more. What you got? Uh, a torso and a leg. Eloise was the prettiest girl, not to others but to you. Her luminous eyes shone brighter than the moon. The day you coloured her for forgery, you wept every tear you had. You never cried again. Jeez. Peace for Magister. Wow. And I've got a leg to go. You stride past the chain sorcerers and climb onto the caravan without complaint. As you settle onto the bench, you offer Relic's blessing to the Magister guard. Hmm. He offers only a bleary-eyed stare of disinterest in return before shoving the chain sorcerers aboard. As you watch them cower, you cannot help but feel annoyance. After all, don't they know they're going to be safe? These fuckers need to oh, wow. die. These fuckers need to die. I don't, I don't care anymore. These fuckers need to die. The cool thing is, from all these body parts, I got two free spells. Oh, sweet. What did you get? So. Right, to the town. Yep. Thing is, the free spells only trigger if you eat them outside combat, which is a bit annoying because I ate a lot of them inside combat because oh, no. I didn't have food left. Oh, there's a there's a boy here. Oh, chickens! Can we talk oh, to yeah. the chickens? Hang on. God no. Talk to the chickens. No. <laughs> he just wants to get the driftwood. What are you up to? Eh, not too out. Just looking for someone. Oh, he's Welsh. Cena, eh, Ben Mez. Oh, him. Hang on. Uh, well, you regret to report that Ifan Ben Mest is dead. Thank you, Ikigo. Thank you. Baron Very much. Like that. Won't like that one little bit. The kid shoves his hands in his pockets and ambles off, resuming his tuneless whistling. Wait, who are we talking about? Uh, Ifan Ben Mazed, the chap that who uh, we helped um, in on the ship. Not yeah. on the ship in Fort yeah. Joy. He stood up for that sorcerer that was being bullied by um, Gadget. Oh him! Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh he's long dead. Yeah. Oh guards. Oh. Oh, oh. Magister guards. Yes. Okay. Right. The older-looking magister notices your presence. He wipes his grubby hands downward across his greaves, as if to wipe Thank you, Susa Donya. Thank you very much. Thank you. More dirt onto them. Halt, Dolph. What word do you bring? Um. Uh, uh, do uh, you know what? I come with no word. I'm simply passing through. Have you seen signs of battle? <laughs> Did you encounter our Magister brothers and sisters? You mean like the huge carnage that's like 20 feet down that road? No, there's, there's, there's not even any remains left. <laughs> they mysteriously disappeared. Uh -huh. I'm going to keep things vague. You've seen many a battle in recent days, but few survivors. Both men remain stiff, as if bracing themselves against an unseen wind. The Void Woken. There were at least half a dozen Magisters out there. They can't all have... Hush, Fader. You may pass, Traveller. Dare say you'll be aching to leave before long anyway. But before you do, find Raymond, the White Magister. He'll want to know what you've seen. Yeah. Be quick, mine. He's set to sail any moment. He nods his head in the direction of the bridge, but offers no other instructions. You're, an, you're now a messenger boy, Quebec. Yeah, for the magisters. For the magisters of all people. I say we keep that information to ourselves. Yeah, fuck them. 
Driftwood, the town of Driftwood. Shopping. 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 Oh, shoes. Accessories. <laughs> Accessories. <laughs> this town is peaceful enough. Let's find out if looks deceive. Woohoo! Traders. 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 <laughs> Been so long. <laughs> right, on. You look down at the cart. Uh, where is? I'm looking for a. I'm off warfare. to the under tavern. Warfare is the main guy. You know, Phoenix Dive. The guy that goes Phoenix capital. Dive. That guy. Which guy? The guy that goes cat. The Asian fella that sells the weapons. My word, but you do uh, look hang on. exhausted. I bet you could use a touch of magic. <laughs> Uh, yep, yep. Right. Sorry, where? What Asian fella? Him? Wait, since when? Sorry, how long have there been silent watchers in the, in the merchant area? For a while, I think. Really? Your fish stinks of no, there weren't. We yeah. haven't noticed. There's loads of magisters. Ah! Uh, starving, along with the rest of this town. There's way more magisters here than last time. Unless I'm being blind. Keep talking to all, and you'll end up eating sawdust from a cell floor. If prices keep going like this, we'll be starving by the end of the morning. Uh, is it your trader there, Emma? Yes. The warfare trader? Yes. Ah, cool. Okay. While you're doing that, then I'll trade potions. Oh, no, wait. Damn it, you two have got them occupied. You bastards. Both of you. Alright, never mind. Uh, this one sells boats. The, uh, uh, who's the fire, the who's the fire so. trader? Uh, the guy, um, yeah, you, that guy. You're talking to him. The short bloke. Okie yeah. dokie. Thank you, Neko. Thank you very much, Neko. Times are tough. We pay okay, more Okay, so I've already gained some favour with the dwarves. Oh, you had a conversation? You need some surprise? Uh, just a quick one, just with oh, my vendor. Stuck up if I were you. It's madness out there. Ah, cool. Never seen anything like it. Okay. Yes, I've got access to the under tavern, if you remember that. Hmm. Sweet, I really need these. I need Phoenix Dive first, though. Fuck right. me, that's expensive. Later, then. Oh, yes. Thank you, Pretzel. Thank it's you very much, so Pretzel. Expensive. Thank you. Fine. Okay. What have we got here? Oh, yes. Expensive, but it's nice. Oh, that was most of my money. Are you done? I'm still carrying around Zyke's talent. Should I just sell it? What to you. I don't know what that is, sorry. Zyke's Talon? Yeah, I'm... I'm The black ring of long studied the toxins that fester the desiccated bodies of the undead. They're charismatic... They're characteristic... They're charismatic <laughs> necromancer, Zyke to tell, was the first to discover that breaking off just one withered finger, a scheming villain can turn a potion of healing into one of poison. Oh, sweetie, you might be able to eat that. It might give you some things about Zyke. Is it a body point? It's a Talon. Oh, so yeah, that's it. Maybe. Let's send it over. I'll give it a look. 17 to 19 there. That's oh. good. Until later, right, I can head back up and get my spells and then get anything else that I need. Put those on. For one of our own. Buy now, Finally. Buy often. What's that? Uh, my Phoenix dive. <laughs> Long last. Yes, I'm going to get the next layer of spells as well. Oh, I need to give Messi a couple of arrows, you're right. Oh my god, these are so expensive. Messi... Emeroids, knockdown arrow. Are you putting these in a bag, Emma? Because it's very good if you do. The carved figure is a uh, not yet. Your Would you like a bag, sweetie? No, I've got a backpack. Yeah, so do I. Just wondered if you wanted to, you know, have no, it. I'll just put it in there now. Holy shit, Q. How have you acquired all that shit? You have stolen it. What? Oh, all those fucking spell books you've got oh, in your I've just, inventory. I've just got them over time. Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah. 
Right, so one of the spells that I'm after, Gag Order, oh yes, it is expensive. My first spell point, Corrupted Blade, Sleeping Arms. Thank you, Peter Pan. Thank you very much, Peter. Thank you. I'm just going to pump back to the Vengeance for a minute. I need to get to the mirror. No worries. I need one point in Warfare for the Phoenix Dive. Are you doing the same, Messi? No, I'm looking for Tarquin. Sure. I don't One remember where he was. Okay. My thievery gloves. Get rid of those. Sell that on, because that's worth quite a bit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Lovely. Right, so Come got back. that, got that, got that knife there. Do need to sell some other stuff. Need to uh, deal some other stuff, to be honest. Cool, there we go. Messy, you hot micing quite a lot there. Sorry. Sorry, it's. Uh, Sorry. My old... Oh dear, <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's so loud. <laughs> no, okay. I'm just. Uh, my old key is the one where I see all the items with, but it's also my voice to... Okay. Uh, let down. Cool. Where is this guy? Nice. Got my phoenix dive. Fantastic. Where the uh, hell did Tarquin go? Just gone, mate. He's, just uh, he's by the rowboat, wasn't he? Yeah, he's not there anymore. Which one scan? Well, I thought I was going to be Spectrum, but then it appears that Digby is now the primary um, talker for the part, um, uh, law master for the party. So, hmm. Hmm. there we are. Lovely. How much cheaper can I get it with the four points? Uh... Right, let's go with main metal helmet. Beautiful. B E A beautiful. Mm -hmm. Glad to see you well. Got that on. Put that. Maybe pinch some gold off of him? Ah, Might be a good idea. Crap. Then I can go and buy the stuff upstairs if I want to. Mm. Probably don't need to just yet. I need to learn those spells that I picked up. Cool. I'm just going to save my gold for a bit until I can afford my next bit. Yeah. Cool. Um, so for the audience's benefit, I've just learnt this ability, which is super useful. Phoenix Dive. It's effectively a teleport for a warrior. So I can move quickly around the battle. All over the place, this is. Wonderful. Right, lock that. Right, now I'm ready. for more spells. Yes, I will be ready very, very shortly. Put those chainmail gloves back on. Yes. Mm. Right, I went and bought myself a legendary dagger from the Under Tavern. Oh, cool. Cost me 1800 gold, but I can afford it. Get back up to the top then. We'll see if there's any daggers over at the just normal melee trader. Hmm. Uh, there's two people back here having a picnic. Were they there before? Where? Over here. Uh, hang on. Where, where's Nicholas, here? And, Nicholas and Glory, by me. Not in any mood to talk about it. I don't think I ever look back there. there. Who are they? I don't know. I'm going to talk. I'm going to talk to Nicholas. All right. Gonna listen in on a conversation. Uh, yeah. Can we listen to this conversation? This would be quite interesting. All right. One second. Oh yes. Who the hell are they? They're over here. Just. Nah. Quebec wouldn't give me the gold. Yeah. We discovered this on the last playthrough. He's very, uh, yeah, he likes his gold. Okay, we're all listening. Saved. Uh, have you not noticed that you're in a void infested land along a void infested sea? <laughs> of course. But there are plenty of magisters around, aren't there? They shield us from sorcerers and void woken alike. <laughs> you're quite right about the sea, though. Why, only a few days ago, I was writhing in pain having eaten from that rotten fish they dare sell on the market. But then a fellow pilgrim passed by, laid his hands upon my feverish skin, and 
Just like that, I was cured. Truly, I... it was a miracle. That pilgrim in question must have been a sorcerer. <laughs> Impossible. A holy man such as he could never be a heathen void lurer. He was a stranger, showing kindness to strangers, exemplifying the teachings of the divine. Definitely a sorcerer. Fills my heart with gladness to know that there are still folks like him to be found. Now that our Lord Alexander has fallen, may the seven keep him. May they keep all of us. I want to murder this smarmy git, but I'm going to talk to his wife instead. Oh, that's his wife. Hang on. Okay. I praise your hospitality and say I'd be delighted. Wonderful. Come, sit, sit. Oh, it's lovely to meet you people on the road. There you go, all cosy. So tell me, are you heading to Ark's like we are? Nicholas and I wouldn't miss Lucian's day for the world. Only in Act 3. <laughs> I may give us like, what, 20 hours of playtime? I may make it to Ark's eventually, but we don't think it'll be for the festival. Oh, Thank you, Hive. Thank you very much, Hive. Please do. The more pilgrims pray for his return, the sooner Lucian will walk among us once more. Just oh. like the prophecy says. <laughs> it's great. I mean, it's great. Oh, good. <laughs> if I'm honest with you, all I wanted to do is get back to my farm. Thank you, Emperor. So come, Thank you very much. Let us break bread and strengthen ourselves for the journey. We have a sacred duty ahead of us. In the holy city of Arx. You eat, drink, and have a good time of it with Glory and her husband, Nicholas. After the meal, you express your thanks and take your leave. Ah. Okay. Well, at least, at, least, at least his wife was pretty nice to me. Yeah. The bloke himself was a bit of a dick. Yeah. Well, they're just clueless. They, they, yeah, they, they don't understand no, the situation. No idea. Yeah. Okay. Uh, now, what shall we do? How long have we got? We've got another half hour. Yes. I'm still trying to find Tarquin, but... Uh, he's on the know. rowboat, next to the rowboat. On the bench. Legendary, legendary blade there. Yeah. Yeah, no, the fucker's Ooh, just yes. disappeared. Yeah, Tarquin's wandered off. Has he? Um, we'll find him again later. That's it. The barrels and the chests. God damn it, but I wanted to buy stuff from him. Yeah, buy it later. I need to travel to the Under Tavern briefly. I just need to get some more gold by stealing it. Sure. I'm all right as long as I don't think about it too much. Okay. You're safe among friends. Never forget it. Yeah. Ooh. Have you anything that would protect against bulls like me? Ah. Is some racing in your background? Sorry, it's motorbikes. Whoa! What the hell was that? Hmm? Did someone just? It was a loud explosion. The uh And again. Quebec, what are you doing? I'm at the trader. Oh fuck. You're right. Yeah, what happened? This shit blown up. I can't cut in, I don't know. The bard clears his throat and gargles on his own saliva. He well rid of some of the shit. Keep that, keep that, get rid of those, that, that. And my keep news has the been thunder rune, yes, something. keep the thunder rune. Wait. Sell, oh no, you sell that, sell the shell, the sell the mushrooms, don't care for them personally. For you and your race. Um, I can sell like half a stack of these. Still gonna have a shitload, sell a painting, keep the essences, sell the rope. Done. I'm just having a look around, really. Yeah, I've picked up a couple of new daggers. Cool. Hmm. Lovely. Yeah, not bad. All this damn work. And then I'll put my armored gloves back on, and good. I've got 115 armor now. What's even the point? And a series nice. of uh, spells to boot. Do oh. we want to potentially free the Meister outside yes. town? Yes. Yeah, sounds good. Sounds good indeed. Uh, we need to go to, to, go to our house first. I'm missing something. Thank you, Das Moo. Thank yes. you very much, Das. Um, also, quick question. Uh, what's a source orb, and how does one acquire one? Um, a source orb um, are just normally like drops and things like that. They just um, uh, occur. And, uh, they're a bit more common later in the game. Sure. Um, okay. And uh, you can either eat them to restore a, store, so, a, store point, a source point, or 
put them um, in various armor slots to yeah. get special effects. Evidently, I need to put one in my armor for some reason. Like yes, know? you do. Thank you, Ethan. Thank you, you very much. gives you a source spell called Mass Cleanse Wounds. That's the one. Right, okay, we'll meet up at the gate then. Yes. So we'll just wait I'm for Messi. I'm fucking, I'm dressed head to toe in chain. Dwar the best dwarven chain mail stolen gold could buy. Right. <clears throat> oh, speaking of... Speaking of chain mail that stolen gold buys, I have 49 physical armor. I need more. Uh, because I'm fucking fragile right now. Well, do you not? What, how does your class do, do armor? How do you get it back? Uh, I can fortify myself. Okay. And that's about it. Really? That's it? Yeah. Okay. So you're quite squishy. I'm very, very fucking squishy. Right then. Mm. Let's go. So uh, let's try and find. The ma master, meister, whatever her name is, who will help us on our quest in uh, towards divinity. And through right, then. totally not metagaming, we know that she's over here. An Be ancient scroll. Because it seems the magisters have found her. Please, why would I kill Lucian's second most charming son? Oh, hello. Shall I talk to him? Yes. Uh, who's got the persuasion? Uh, yes, you talk to her. Yeah, yeah. I will talk to the executioner. <coughs> you have more than oh, one messy. point in it by now. Yes. <laughs> okay. You got to read the first line. We can't hear it. Step Never away mind. from the prisoner. Um. Right. I'm gonna set this prisoner free, and you be wise and look the other way. You're going to. What, now? I mean, you can set her free yourself if you like. She betrayed Alexander. I'd sooner die than free her. <sighs> Be prudent. The maester the maester is a powerful spirit. If she dies here, she may linger even in the afterlife. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'll regret this. I know I will. All right. Please. I'll stand aside. I wanted to use my daggers. Oh, I wanted to fight. Say, I thought we wanted to Damn kill it. them. Now, now you start to become persuasive. Alright. Oh. One time I want to try out my new attack. <laughs> Wouldn't have been much of a fight anyway, to be fair. Welcome yeah. to Driftwood, Godwoken. One bloody eye cracks open, glittering gold appearing from beneath the swollen lid. Chased. <laughs> Chased you all the way here from Fort Joy, did they? Very well then, cut me down. There is work to be done. Or indeed you could stand there gawping as if you were a cow ordered to dance a reel. This is a masterful performance. I would applaud it, but well. Thank you, Altharius. Thank you very much. Thank you. Be quick about Most it. kind. Who knows when that magistrate might return? I quickly saw through her restraints and held her down. God's teeth, it feels good to move again. Now, best scurry off before that magister wanders Thank you, back. Alessandro. Thank you magistrate. very much. Thank you. And we can see what you're made of. Lovely. We freed the me the Meister. She can't see where she's going because she's all the ro Oh yeah, yeah. Gravity has affected yeah. the bell. Okay, so we freed the lady that will apparently assist us in becoming Godwoken, and we're to meet her back at her house. So let's follow her. Run through the shallows. Jump drowning. Thank you, Paint. Oh, you're, <laughs> too, <laughs> you're too short. <laughs> I don't know. I don't see the issue. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, it's like it's like a miniature shark. Look at his head. Yeah. I just noticed he can literally headbutt me in the quatch. Yes. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I'm not picking that up. Right. So, into her, into her home. The Meister oh, sits slumped, yeah. the Meister sits yeah, slumped in a chair, room, looking around the room as she works her shoulder with one it hand. Like it, was it looks as though it were, it were dislocated by the gallows. Damnable red cloak baboons ransacking my wardrobes. As if I would keep ancient valuable secrets in a pearl with my unmentionables. She takes a deep breath, and with a twist, a click, and a screech of pain, she shoves her shoulder back into its socket. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. I swear by the seven if, <laughs> if we did not have more important matters to attend to. Reaching across the table, she pulls a bowl of hot water towards her and fishes some bandages, a needle and thread out of a box. She slowly starts to tend to her wounds. At least the barbarians were unable to club their way into my vault, so everything you need should be safe. Okay. Uh, what exactly do you need? In your case, 
More than I suspect, man. God or even reptile can provide. However, we must soldier on. It is not enough to be God woken in order to ascend to divinity. There is a process. As she speaks, the Meister uncorks a vial of shimmering liquid, sauce. She lets a couple of drops fall on her hand, but instead of infusing with her body, they quickly evaporate on her scales. Hmm. She stares at the empty spot on her palm for a long moment before turning back to you, continuing as if nothing had happened. What's that about? Not sure. I don't know. Hmm. Kind of healing tonic a or something? A process by which God woken may ascend. It begins with discovering your deepest self, delving into your own soul. Uh, okay. W won't be a long journey in my case. <laughs> uh, okay, so I guess we want to get started as quickly as possible. Enthusiasm? On a weekday? My word. We shall begin once we have <laughs> the tools we need from my vault. You may have been chosen, Godwoken, but becoming divine requires more than a supernatural pat on the head. Aww. Come, Godwoken. It is time to see just how awake you are. Fortunately, the okay. Magisters pay as much attention to our <laughs> yeah. fashion. Can nice. we steal shit first? Kindly remove that painting yeah. from the wall. I might go and get a, my, one of my source spells, to be honest, just briefly. I'll be two uh, seconds. Sure, sure. The tavern. Uh, anything worth noting? Run back upstairs Apple and pay for it. Cut. It's gonna it's gonna cost me a million pounds, and I'm ready for it. Alright. I've got two legendary knives, I'm really happy I picked them up. Thank you very much, Zeal. Thank you for subbing. Thank you. Very kind, thank you. Oh, we can make some cheese. Butter even. Okay. <laughs> You're just gonna stick that in your pocket, are you? Yep. Alright. Just you take taking an entire butter churn. I can sell it. <clears throat> right. Oh, that's so Push expensive. Give me um, that, give me that. Yeah. Let's wait for a callback. Now Tell me where that. That. Give me that. What don't I want? Moment will take bless off. I'll have that. Jesus. I'll have that. I'll have that and the lid. Ooh. I'll have that. Yeah. I just lifted up my arm. Like the skin beneath my arm is peeling. I think I think I've got scabies. Oh, right there. I need three scoundrel. Hang on, okay, I'm just, I'll just gonna bite my arm off. Yeah. What? Sorry, I need to go back to the vengeance in a bit to respec, but I'll do that later. Do it later. I'll have that. I'll I'm have running. that. Uh, Hop I'll have that. Right, there's a button. Yeah, yeah, we just pressed it. No, oh, I already pressed it. <laughs> ah. So look what you've done to the bed now. It's floating. <laughs> no, no, look at it. Through the wall. Through the wall. Uh, uh, well done. Magic. Magic. Okay, I'm going down the hatch. Uh, IKEA skills going wrong. Going down the hatch. Oh, okay, you're going down the hatch. Oh dear. It's broken the fourth wall. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's very good. I enter the safe, my nation, as the magister calls it out. Taking your time, you carefully Ooh, enter the combination. Sound effects. The metallic sounds of the tumblers falling within the mechanism let you know you entered the code correctly. Excellent. Follow me. Your time is at hand, God. God. Okay, powerful awakening. Are you seriously telling me the Magister didn't find the cellar that's under the bed? Weird Apparently not. Feel free to look about like Source! Yes! Nom 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 nom. And try not to break anything in the this meantime. This place is an arcanist's dream. Nice. It is in fact an arcanist's dream. Uh, on Ooh. Source Orbs, a bucket. Ancient Ooh. runes. Weird contraptions. This place is an arcanist's dream. Hold on, we let me also that. let me complete the circle. Ancient rooms, weird contraptions. This place is an arcanist. How did you do that? What did you click I on? I walked into the I walked into the room. Ah, I've already done it. You've already nice. done it. All right. Cool. Okay, so the alchemist has got a small cellar down here. Bits and bobs that we're totally stealing. Yeah. Oh. Very nice. These have cleaned their fucking house out. <laughs> yeah, the, we're stealing more than the Magisters did. Oh, wow. What? It's gonna be like that, do you know the Simpsons movie? Where, like, the fucking the power goes out in Moe's bar, and he's like, <laughs> Alright, very funny. 
Well, I'm going to turn the lights back off. And when I come back on, I want all my boobs back where it was. <laughs> and he's just in his pants, like, when he turns the light back <laughs> <on>. <laughs> That's exactly what's happening. Um, well, I'm gonna... Is anyone polymorphing? Oh, uh, nope. don't, don't look this way. I may have accidentally taken my clothes off. What? Where? <laughs> How? <laughs> what? How did you manage that? How did you manage that? Gave you a chest. Yeah, Jesus. Jesus. Oh, a small woodland but, uh, creature that's attached you'll, to your... You'll lose the chest hair off as well. Yeah, uh, hold on. Joe wins that. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> right, what do you say to me? Let's box. Oh, God. Let's... Oh, no, God. no, no. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Both of you put your bloody clothes back on. Imagine my chest. Ah, ah, oh. oh, God, it's horrible. Ah, there's, oh, a, there's a skeleton lady. It is. Oh, that's weird. Hang on, do I get my baps out? Asking the important questions. Oh, I do! Holy shit! <laughs> what kind of cheap ass bra is that? What? It's not bad, it, you know. It sort of holds them together. It's not dwarven forged. It it's holds like, them together. It's like two apricots <laughs> and a handkerchief, isn't it? To, to be honest, it looked like two snooker balls in a rugby sock. That's what they look like. <laughs> uh, uh, right, okay. <laughs> what was it? Some, someone on Reddit describing twerking uh, as two midgets trying to escape a circus, t a circus tent. <laughs> <laughs> <Don't be long. laughs> I can't. I can't look at twerking the same way again. <clears throat> right. Okay. What are we doing? Um. I don't know. <laughs> don't try, keep it together. Uh, okay. Right. I'm going to talk to the, the meister. Is examining her the wounds. meister is examining her wounds. This, prodding, prodding at this. At squinting at that. Face her face, her face seems to... grim as she turns to you. Take me. I'm here. Stand by. What is happening? Take me. I'm, I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm Join here, the conversation. Here. Do you know what it means to have the power of the divine, Godwoken? Uh, it means you have the power to do anything you want. Meister Silverstein bores into your soul. It is still, analytical, and ice cold. Indeed, some people seem to think so. Mostly they're idiots, <laughs> but in some cases they're mad dogs. The Meister rests her hand on uh, her arm, you. where one of her yeah. wounds has just reopened. She squeezes hard, ignoring the trickle of blood running down her claw. I pray you're more idiot than mad dog. It would be a shame to expend all this effort just to see you put down. Uh, Bristol at a suggestion. Is that a threat? Not in the least. All of my threats are delivered tied to the end of a poison-tipped arrow. It saves time in the long run. The Meister sits back in her chair. Golden Thank you, Cammy. Thank you kindly. You Thank you. Claws. The Divine is not all-powerful. More powerful than any other true, but not all powerful. While some of us have a thimble of sauce, others have a cup. A sorcerer can sip from their cup and use their sauce to perform powerful magic. The divine sips from a lake of sauce, but they sip all the same. And to seal this world off from the void woken will take every drop of that power. Okay. Uh, I observe her cuts and say that they look pretty bad. Indeed. If only there were a divine here to heal my poor mortal body. Or a healer. <laughs> oh, hang on a minute. Oh. Cause bless on her. The Meister goes quiet for a hang moment, a staring at the gashes that crisscross her body. If granted divinity, you would have the power of all seven gods at your disposal. You could heal any wound, pull islands from the sea, right any injustice. But make no mistake. The Divine has only one duty, to protect this world from the Void. The Divine cannot use her power for anything else. Uh, hold up a hand. Hey. Surely, surely you can use some power for yourself. When you become the Divine, Thank you, there Bailey. is no more self. For just a moment. Thank you very much, Bailey. She looks at you. It is no small thing to ask, but it is your duty. Without a new Divine, Rivalon will die. Okay. Uh, I nod, so I'm already thinking about what I would do with such power. Very well, then. Let's see if we can't snatch divinity from the jaws of the void. The ritual itself is quite simple. Drop some black root in the bowl, mix in a little blood, set the concoction aflame, and then inhale the smoke. 
Ignore any feelings of dizziness, burning in your lungs, or a dire sense of existential dread. They're all perfectly normal. Although you will need to sacrifice a little sauce along the way. Everything you need is here. Ingredients in the cupboard. Sauce in the glowing fountain. Ritual in the tome by the bookcase. Even an incinerator to provide a flame. The Meister looks back at her wounds, curiously prodding them as fresh blood oozes out, staining her claws. Okay, I'll get started immediately. And do not lose anything. These ingredients are rare indeed. I'm not hiking back out to the cloisterwood to fetch you more blackroot. Okay, so uh, blackroot, blood, flame, and she says sacrifice a bit of sauce. So, uh, do we have to? Do we? Is one person prepares the concoction, right? Not all of us. Yeah, one person do it, and we'll all uh, huff off that person's so, stash. So yes, I'm gonna let I'm gonna let you guys figure it out. So here's I've, a bowl. I've done this a million times. So I'm gonna sit back and watch. Yeah, where's the black root? Here? No, it's empty. Uh, Okie dokie. What does what does Daddy Higby have in his, ha oh, in his bag? Ingredients. Opening the door. Here we go. You see a select. After a quick rummage, you spot okay. you gather up the black. Okay, I've got the black root. I've got them all here. So put the black root in the bowl. You've got it as well. Yeah. Do, do I just go over to the quest thing? Maybe. Hang on. Okie dokie. Ancient bowl. Black root, obsidian lance. No, ah. How do you how do you combine them? Have you done it? Hmm. Hmm. Let me consult the ancient bow. Oh, combine with. Sorry, I see. Place a single piece of black root in the ritual bowl. Draw blood with the obsidian lance and sprinkle it upon the root. There we Set go. Set a flame to the bowl and its contents. There we go. Oh, no. Have you done it? So I've got, the, I've got the thing in the bowl. Now what do I do? Do I stick the bowl here? That's your inventory, not mine. No, I haven't put blood in it yet. Go stand on top of it. I'll set it again. Hang on, I'll just do this. That works. Cool. And then... I think you need to, like, actually stab yourself. Uh, okay. Out of the way, lesser mortal. Have you got it? Alright. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Try again. Hey, there you go. Okay, and then breathe that in. Here we go. As you suck the smoke, see you on the other your side. Lungs, your vision starts to swim and cloud. There is an intense pounding in your head, and you can feel the world fading. Okay, uh, hold the fumes in my lungs and ignore the thumping in my head. As the world fades away, you lose all sense of being grounded. You reach out, but you could feel yourself falling slowly, sinking into the depths of your own soul. Here we go. Right, so I'm just alone with the audience now, so speaking to Twitch. So my character has been pulled into the Hall of Echoes, which is like an underworld. We're here to try and find Ralik, the human god. My sponsor, as it were. There... Wait, that's me, Lady Lump. Hello. Bathed in the half-light of these starless bands, you spot a figure you could only describe as a second self. It looks haggard and weak. It's very voice, but a feeble echo of your own. My chosen, come, come closer, so that you may see me as I truly am. I step closer. Look me, in the eyes. The apparition clasps your face in its shaking hands. You suddenly feel your eyes tingle. Everything becomes brighter, sharper. Blacks and whites become glorious bursts of color, then fade back into their accustomed spectrum. Blind eyes shine brightly. Speak the spell and see. Okay, so I've learnt spirit vision. So last time I was here, Ralik taught me how to bless things with source. I've now learnt the spell spirit vision, which when I cast it, which is innate, costing a single point of source, I believe. Oh, wait. Here it is. We will see things that mortals cannot see. That is the strange mirror image of yourself. Before you stands the god Ralik in all his spectral glory. You know me now, don't you? 
I saved you from drowning. I blessed you, made you powerful. And now I've come to seek some power in return. Your God-woken soul is my last refuge, my last bastion. May as well make the best of what you have to offer. Ralik nourishes himself from the source that abounds in your presence. You feel it deep down inside yourself. Ah, yes. Just what I needed. I tell you, dying just doesn't become a god. So, so it's worth noting that effectively the, the gods of the Seven are, are they're almost, or at least they, they are apparently almost parasitical. So Ralik is not a god in our definition. It's more like he's a some sort of spirit, some sort of entity. He's powerful, yes, but he's attached himself to me, his champion, and is leeching off source, so the primordial magic that I'm, I'm gathering. So, um, yeah, he's, eff he's effectively attached himself to me like a limpet. Uh, tell him not to be too greedy. Frankly, I need all the source I can get. Don't you dare to be ungrateful after all I've done for you. I sheltered you. Now you must shelter me. The void itself is hunting down the gods. Leeching us in ways we never thought possible. Droplet by droplet, we are being drained. Indeed. We're battling for our very survival. Thank you, Kraldin. Thank you very losing. much. And should we truly lose, all will be cast into oblivion. Is that really true, though? Okay, there must be some way to save him. To save us both, as a matter of fact. You must realize that our fates are now as one. Thank you, Potato. Just as Thank our you. souls are now as one. We are I. Nah. Together we are a force to be reckoned with. But if we seek to survive the onslaught of the void, we stand no chance unless we become vastly more powerful than we are now. Yes, uh, Foronov in the chat. Yeah, an energy vampire. That's a, that's a fairly accurate way of... Yeah, the, the gods are effectively energy vampires and they feed off a of source. Where that source comes from, we'll find out during the course of the game. But it's clear that they are not the... Well... They're not certainly not, not in control of the world. That means there is but one Thank you, Mark. place we can go. Thank you kindly. The Well of Ascension. I look at him expectantly. That name doesn't ring a bell. It is a lake, a pool of pure source in which the powers of the seven lie united. We gave them up freely to create the first divine. Each of us donated half of that which makes us gods. To bathe in the lake is to become our chosen. That is where the road to divinity leads, and you must be the first to reach it at all costs. Why is it so important that I should win? Surely a new divine, any new, div new divine would do. There you touch upon the very heart of the matter. The void is stronger than ever. A new divine won't be enough. You need to go to the well of ascension, not to bathe in the source of the seven, but to take it, all of it. Only she who claims everything Thank you, Lydek. Thank everything. you. The Void's doom. This world's liberator. Pause to wonder what will happen to the other gods. And Godwoken, if I do this. It's very simple, really. They will either bow to you, or be undone. Okay, so effectively each and, and bear in mind that Quebec and Messi and Digby are getting the same spiel from their respective race gods. The gods are raising champions to go to the Well of Ascension and steal all the power of the gods. Even the power that they did not donate. But of course, that is what they are saying to their own god Woken as we speak. As he said. We both know they won't bow, just like we both know you will never bow to them. Only one can become a god strong enough to safeguard our world. One. At the expense of all others. So make no mistake, my champion. Chances are the road to divinity will be paved with dead gods. Their blood on your murderous hands. But don't let that dismay you. For these sins will be washed clean by the knowledge you committed them to save all of existence. Thank you, Miss. To save Thank your you, Mister. Thank you kindly. And your loved ones, and the world they live in. What will happen to all the other races? They will be at your mercy, which is vastly preferable to you being at theirs. Wouldn't you agree? So fret not, but revel in the promise of the lake. I will lead you there when you're ready. When you become a true master of the source and speak the language of creation itself. Our journey will be fraught with peril. It is a pilgrimage of challenges that will require you to command source like only a godwoken can and wield its most powerful spell. 
Blake in the chat asks, so are you going to stab your friends in the back? That's what makes this, uh, this Neverwinter Nights, well, this is effectively Neverwinter Nights, but this is part of what makes this so interesting. Effectively, your party is united, but at the same time, not, not everyone can become a divine. Only one of us will become the divine. Who will it be? Who will it be? Thank you, Rune and Phil. Thank you. Um, right. Okay. Um, uh, okay. Uh, smile wryly and say that the pilgrimage sounds rather ironic given your mission. Hoarse laughter rolls and echoes into infinity. Perhaps. But what is a pilgrimage after all? If not a journey of atonement in search of enlightenment. Focus not on death and irony, my chosen. On life and ascension instead. We are I now. The spells you need to know I will teach you when you are ready. But first you must learn to channel the source in greater volumes. That is why you need to seek masters of the source. Okay. You must make them teach you so that you may become a master in turn. So, return to Rivalon and seek out these sages where they dwell. Convince them to share with you their deep-seated bond with the source. Once you have, you may return to me here. Okay. So yes, effectively he's saying, go back to Rivalon, find other sorcerers, get them to teach me how to, be how to be get better at using the source in order to eventually become his chosen champion and go to the Well of Eternity and steal all of it. The Well of Ascension, even. What am I thinking of? Well of Eternity. I'm thinking of, um, wow, aren't I? Same thing, really. The Sunwell. Right, I take my leave. Best of luck, my champion. Okay. Chronicle continues. Master the source. And of course, I've now got spirit vision. So long as I have source, uh, I will be able to see things that, no, that mortals cannot. How do I get out of here? Do I talk to him again? Oh, there, sorry. Hello. Hello! Hang on a second. Thank you, not uh, at what. Not. Wait. Not a once definitely. Thank you kindly. There is the spirit of an elegant elven woman materializing before me. Is there? What's that there? There is. I don't know. She's talking to me. Oh, you used spirit vision. Oh, she was just here when I got back. Oh. Yeah, Quebec's been back for a while, I think. Cool. Are we all in the conversation? I'm just listening to him, his talk with the Meister. Uh, who, sorry, someone's talking to the Meister? Yeah, Quebec is. Oh, shit, okay, oh. we're in the wrong conversation. Hang on. Uh, I can't get out of it. Okay. The Meister doubles over in a violent coughing fit. Thank you, Black Lur. Thank you. I can't get out of this After conversation a few moments, with the, she with the elven spirit. All right, wait a minute. A thin smear of blood from the corner of her mouth. No matter what is asked of you, you must learn from them. There we go. I'll speak to you again in a sec. All right. Go back. You with us? We can't hear us. The Magisters have kept ledgers with all known sorcerers, especially the powerful ones not yet captured. They would be an invaluable resource. Okay, so the Magisters... But you'd be careful not to get caught. I was their <laughs> guest for a time. And I promise you the gallows was the most comfortable part of the experience. And if their barracks turns out to be as empty as their skulls, just try to keep an ear to the ground. There may still be powerful sorcerers hiding in these lands. As she speaks, one of her wounds reopens, a dark red stain spreading across her tunic. She hisses in frustration and starts to bind the gash. I wish there was more I could do, but in this condition, I would be more a hindrance than a boon. Godspeed, and remember, do whatever it takes. Okay. Go to speak to the apprentice. Sure. Uh, it's Quebec. Hang on, Quebec's not here. Quebec, you with us? Oh, sorry. We're just, just gonna. Jo we were in that conversation with you. Uh, we're just gonna. Oh, right. We're just gonna uh, talk to this apprentice. I am the Meister's apprentice. I study under her, but I do not learn. I hear tales of the ritual, of what lies beyond... Thank you, might go crazy. Such Thank you. Such wonders, such powers. I decide to pursue them myself. Meister tells me it cannot happen, that I am not Godwoken. But in my heart, I know I am special. Uh -huh. I try, 
I'd burn the root. I breathe the smoke and it burns me back. No air fills my lungs. Thank you, brownies. Only fire. When the darkness falls, I cannot cry out. I leave my life behind with a shameful whimper. Why did you risk such a thing if you're aware of the dangers? The spirit looks at you regretfully. It is hard to hear of such power and not covet it for yourself. I lie to myself and convince myself that I am special. But I am not special. I am dead. Amen. Yep. She got greedy. Hmm. Yeah. Cool. Thank you, Khan. Thank you. Thank you, Khan. Thank you. Cool. Sorry. Thank uh, you, whoever that was. Um, was right. Very kind of you. <laughs> so, uh, we had a conversation with our... Uh, nothing happened. I, I felt a bit woozy there when I breathed in the smoke. Yeah. Squirrel's yeah, exactly. nose yeah. twitch. Yeah. Um, so, we're out of time, though. Yes, unfortunately. We but have reached the end. But we're here in Driftwood, which is good. So, yeah. Um, and we've just been informed that we need to... Uh, sorry. <clears throat> um, I think we should perhaps look at... Uh, see if there are other people who can teach us more about the source. What do you, what do you think? Well, the, yes. mice, the Meister yeah. said that, but well, which which we all knew about. Good, uh, yes, a good idea, my Meister. Meister, we, we should do yes. that next time, next Sunday, yeah. Absolutely. Yes. 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 Sounds good. Sounds good. That the adventure will continue next Sunday at eight o'clock, everybody. Wonderful. Wonderful. Dub 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 dub. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I I was trying to finish it with a flourish. Oh dear. It was terrible. <laughs> Right, yeah. I'm at it. I'm at it. I'm Fuck ashamed. You. <laughs> right, you saved it. Yep, it's all saved. Cool. Hurrah! Right then. Yes. Toodaloo. No, good game. Uh, yeah, so good fun. Glad to be in Driftwood. Yes. Right. Cool. I, I shall smell you later. Yes, I'm See gonna. You later. Have a good one. Bye -bye. See you soon. Bye. -bye. I might keep going. I don't know what I'm gonna play, but I might keep going. All right. Cool. All right, I'll, I'll see about a host. So it depends who's on. Right. Ready, ho. Bye. Bye. Right. Okay. Uh, oh, hang on a minute. Got a Steam message. I won't show it on the stream though. Um, hang on a second. Right. Um, so thank you for thank you for watching everybody. So that was a spot of Divinity uh, Divinity Two, uh, the Definitive Edition, which is an expansion pack they made where they were apparently they were quite unhappy with the ending, so they changed it quite considerably. So and, and added a bunch of extra bits. So uh, we're just playing it through again because we wanted to see those extra bits really. Um, so yes, that's uh, I believe the start of chapter two. And uh, we've uh, escaped the prison and we've arrived at Driftwood where we are uh, effectively trying to get get more knowledge insofar as the source is concerned so we can, uh, well, ascend to godhood, basically, or divinity. Um, right, so before I go, it's uh, six minutes past ten on a Tuesday evening, uh, just, to get, just to get people informed as to what's going on. It's the start of the sixth week of work on the latest YouTube video. Six weeks is a long time. I'm sorry. Um, I'm, I'm trying my best, but it's very difficult. It's, it's very, it's, it's very hard. Um, but I need to get it done this week. I, I, I can't. It can't be a seven weeker. I have to finish it this week. Um, it's um, so it's a video essay. It's a, it's part ten of ten of a of a video essay series. Uh, a playlist that I'm going to put on YouTube when it's all done, um, and it's uh, it's basically me talking about the Daisy mod and the Daisy standalone. Uh, it's a project that I've been doing for a couple of years now, on and off, uh, uh, very on and off. Like for example, the last time I worked on this was in January, uh, so you know, th then I did bullshitteries, and then you know, just stealing away some time to do this. Um, <clears throat> so. Yes, sixth week of sixth week of work. The video is nearly done. I'm just going to try my best and get it get it done as soon as I can. Um, thank you, Kirby One Hero. Thank you, Kirby One. Thank you kindly. Thank you. Um, so yeah, so uh, work continues. In addition, uh, this week I'm hoping to pick up my first ever car, um, which I'm super excited about. I, I paid for it, so I sent the bank transfer to pay for it uh, this earlier this week. Uh, thank you guys. Uh, effectively, you got well. Thanks to your generosity, I can. I finally got my first car. So thank you guys sincerely. Really much appreciated. I, I couldn't afford it before. So uh, thank you very much, everyone. Um, so um, yeah, I'm, I'm psyched. I can't wait. Uh, so I'm probably going to pick it up on Friday, and then probably crash, and then that that'll be it from me because I'll be dead uh, <laughs> on the, on over the weekend. Uh, I had a good run. I had a good run indeed. Um, so yes, I'm just going to. What am I going to do now? Uh, I don't have the energy to keep working, I think. I'm just going to go and wind down and... Yeah, I'm just going to wind down and go to bed soon, I think. And then I'll, I'll get on with work tomorrow morning. Um, 
so yes, uh, so uh, Freddie, what type of car is it? Uh, I, I, I don't wish to tell you the manufacturer, uh, just for personal real life identity reasons, because it's a giant piece of metal and plastic that sits outside one's abode, uh, you know. Um, but um, it's a two door uh, coupe, like a two door little zippy coupe, um, which I can use to get around the city. So uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I like it. Uh, it's a nice colour and um, yeah, I look forward to uh, driving it around. Um, right, so let me just have a look and see uh, who is currently playing what. Let's have a look. Uh, so, Cyanide is doing Armour 3. I think he's just finishing though. He's on the exit screen. He's either he's either finishing or he's starting round 2. Okay, Quebec has gone offline. Uh, Digby's starting up a game of something. Swat Knight is playing Lego Star Wars. And Yuki is playing Minecraft. Okay, hang on a second. Let me just see. Oh, no, but yes, I just finished. She's gone offline. Um, okay, well, in which case, i hand you over to, D to Digby then. So, um, cool. But hang on a second. Don't know what he's doing. I can't select his name. There we go. Cool. Right, so thank you again. Thank you for watching. All the best. Have a lovely evening. I'll be back tom tomorrow morning, uh, unless I'm working. We'll see. And, um, yeah. And then, of course, tomorrow tomorrow evening, I'll be here for some uh, for some VR games with ZF, as, as we do every Wednesday. So, um, yeah. So have a lovely, lovely one. All the best and sleep well, folks. Take care.